Hello, 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 and welcome to another edition today. Is the Thursday edition, ladies and gentlemen, and we are back. Welcome, guys. We got Clay McDonald in the building. Uh, Mr. Jason Suter is here. Brett Azanga, DJ Jimmy T, Timothy Fout. Hannah, what's up, Hannah? You made it to a live. That's awesome. Uh, we got uh, Mr. Donnie Denfield as well. Drop the slacker button. Sorry about the slacker chat. Now, here's the deal, chat. So, I was going to continue my journey as a uh, as my grandpa's successor to the farm uh, that we did the last time we played this game. But, unfortunately, I, apparently, this game does not auto-save potatoes right now. Potatoes immediately for this. This game does not automatically save, which is a basic feature of every game that exists like this. <laughs> so, I lost my save. I guess I didn't save it. I had no save. I have no idea how to save in this game. But, and this is a giant butt chat. Uh, do you know what, it, what does auto save? What, uh, what does auto save? <laughs> yeah, I have no save file at all. So, but, but, I actually found something. Instead of canceling the stream, which is what I wanted to do, I found a jungle fire hemp farm challenge. So apparently you can grow fields of weed in Colombia and have to rescue it from a jungle fire. <laughs> so that sounds even more fun, actually. Yeah. So maybe it's a blessing in disguise. You know what I'm saying, chat? It might be a blessing in disguise, guys. We just don't know. Uh, better than SnowRunner. That might be better than SnowRunner. We don't know. <laughs> uh, so yeah, basic gamer rule. You always hit save. Yeah, apparently, I didn't even know there was a save, Timothy. I looked in the in the options, uh, and I did not even see a save. I don't even know how to save. Maybe you have to save like in your tablet or something. Yeah, so we might try that. I don't know if it's going to be awesome, Holly. It might be. But, uh, yeah, we're going to try this one instead. So, <laughs> yeah. Uh, hello, Ryan. And chat, uh, send potatoes. Yeah, we need to send potatoes for sure. Uh, what's up there? Mr. R2 says, hempy right. Yeah, I'm going to be very hempy today for sure. Um, what's going on there? Jason, how you doing there, buddy? He's dropping those tomatoes. Denver says, did you know farm still auto saves? No, I didn't know that. No, no, they don't. No, they, they, that's not possible. There's no way that, that auto saves and it's better than this. No, <laughs> I refuse to accept it. Uh, yeah, my thumbnail was a beach club when I joined. I know. I don't know why that's happening, Marcus, because the thumbnail, the thumbnail for the video should be, why, why is the thumbnail for the video, the beach party still? Uh, the thumbnail for the video, let me just look at this here, chat. I uploaded it. Let me just look at this. What the heck is going on? Dude, it is for me too. Look, look, why is it the beach club simulator? Why? I updated it. Here, let me update the thumbnail again. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it again, chat. I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> Hold on, let me let me update it again. Hopefully it fixes it, even though it's already destroyed. Uh let me give it a shot here. Yeah, it's showing me the farm. It's showing me the farm thing. I'm gonna update it again. Let's upload that again. Save it. All right. Let's see what happens now. Um, Raya's not going to get any work to, done today. No. All right. I updated it, uh, the thumbnail again. Now let's see, chat. Now let's go to my channel. And uh, let's see if it updated. It still didn't update. Yeah, it still didn't update. I don't know what's going on with that. Why is that happening? <laughs> why is that happening? I have no idea why. Uh, that sucks. That really sucks. That screws everybody up. Now everybody's going to think we're just playing yesterday's game. Um, shark still. Yeah, yeah, I don't know why. I, I I updated the thumbnail. I don't know why it's not updating. It makes no sense, chat. Um, thank you, Harry B. Oh, what is Harry? Oh, is Harry being supportive? Thank you for being, like, one of the last supportive people here. I appreciate that, Harry. <laughs> my goodness, my friend. Holy cow. Number one fan and five gifted subs for the chat. Thank you, buddy. What a stand-up guy. Uh, how did you break YouTube? Um, I don't know, John Colley. I, I don't know. Everything's broken today. My save file's gone. Um, my my thumbnail is gone. Uh, it's showing correctly on my dashboard now. Oh, it is? Okay, so it's finally updated. I appreciate that, buddy. Thank you very, very much, my friend. Okay, let me take a look at this. Um, it still didn't update for me, though. Son of a stink. <laughs> it's, it's still the stupid shark for me. Yeah! You're saying it updated, Dan? Really, buddy? Interesting. Thank you very much for those five gifted subs as well, Harry. Who got those gifted from you, buddy? Who got them? 
Um, we got Dustin Coffee, Cat, Adam W, and Punky Brew. Congrats on the gifted. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. I mean, I did look at the window and it's correct now. Yeah, I know, but now it's too late. Now everyone's gonna think, oh, yeah, he, he streamed yesterday's game. <laughs> Try refreshing. I did, Zachary. I refreshed like four times, buddy. It is not updating for me. I don't know why. Good on yours. Okay, good. Okay, it updated. Cool. All right. As long as you guys can see it, hopefully people that are just skimming through YouTube will see it as well. And uh, hopefully they will actually, you know, click on the stream. Probably not. <laughs> Thank you very much there, Harry V and Harry V for the support. I appreciate it there, buddy. Uh, I mean, yesterday's game was good. It was. Yeah, yesterday's game was good. I'm not going to knock it, you know. But it's like it's like always like uh, a little bit, you know, less whenever we stream something twice. So, But anyways, we're going to do this Colombian farming challenge. So uh, let's do this jungle fire. Now, there's actually a lot of challenges here, which is kind of awesome. They have a Montana challenge, which was the first uh, map that we played. The sunny harvest. We have a potato campaign, a huge drought, locust attacks, <laughs> a trucker's life. Like you could do some trucking. Uh, in Milky Way, which is like cows. I'm sure Denver would love that one. Um, we also have a uh, Colombian jungle fire, which is awesome. Exotic mechanic, rainy season, best coffee beans, and unknown disease, which is pretty cool. And then there's like an Italy one where you'd get to do olive tasting, young, like olives and wine. And then there's, there's like, and then there's Japan where you can do like white gold. What is white gold chat? What is that? Uh, Japanese white gold. Japanese, the symbol of life, uh, planting time, harvest, perfect logistics. So there's like all kinds of like places with uh, with challenges here. That's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome, actually. Um, hello, everyone. What's up there, Frank Mason? How you doing there, buddy? <clears throat> oh, it's Rice. Yeah, it's Rice. We got Timothy Thunder coming in with a 15 months. Thank you, Timothy Thunder. Appreciate it, buddy. He says hello, Raya. What's up, man? Thank you for the 16, or I'm sorry, 15 months of team Raya, buddy. Appreciate it, my friend. Rice. Yeah, it's Rice. All right. Let's get into it, though. We're going to get into it. What's up, Kyle? How you doing there, buddy? Uh, we got Dan Danis into the building as well. Jay Solmer uh, is laughing at me for some reason. <laughs> uh, what's up there, Pat Bessler? What's up, Nikki Lizzie? Good to see you guys. Good to see you guys. All right, let's get started, chat. We're going to do this challenge here. Uh, we're going to start early, guys. Uh, Rise new nickname is White Gold. That's true there, Lee. You're absolutely right there, buddy. Guys, tap that like as well. Make sure better than SnowRunner. It is already better than SnowRunner, guys. Look at this, chat. Oh, we disconnected. Oh, you got to be kidding me. So I did not drop any frames on my end. All right, YouTube, YouTube's YouTube's all fudged up, chat. I was going to beep a, a word there. <laughs> YouTube's definitely all fudged up. I did not lose internet there. I had a strong connection throughout that, and then it dropped for no reason, guys, while we're back. Yeah, we're, we're already having connection issues. So obviously with a thumbnail issue and then a connection issue, uh, YouTube is definitely having some issues today. That's, that's wonderful. Wonderful. Thank you, YouTube. As if my stream wasn't doing... Terrible enough. Uh, you have to ruin it some more. Um, I thought it was mine mess my LTE messing up. No, Robert. That was YouTube there, buddy. <laughs> oh, it's back. Well, that's good. Okay. All right. So apparently we have to save. Did I even read the challenge? Hold on. Let me let me go read the challenge now. We gotta read the challenge. <laughs> it's good now. It was buffering. Yeah, Hank. I don't know what's up with that, buddy. I don't know what's going on, my friend, but something's going on with YouTube. Uh, next up, tissue issues. Yeah, I got tissue issues today, chat. Okay, so sunny harvest. Um, DM DMV is down nationally. Really? The DMV is down? What's going on there, Brad? Uh, number four just dropped. Number four? What's number four, guys? Uh, he had to log on to farm secretly. <laughs> no, I wasn't secretly logging on. Chat, hey. Do you, do I look like a man that would, uh, play another farming game then secretly log in to farm sim just to play that and then fake an outage just to do that? Absolutely not. All right, so Colombia says Colombia is a country full of scenic vistas and vast forests. Occasionally, prevalent heat can cause forest fires. This time, the fire broke out not far from your farm. You have to save your crops from the oncoming flames. So we have to save our crops from flames, guys. The DMV is absolute headache. Yeah, I don't know how we. I don't know how uh, the DMV goes down. Isn't that like a government system? How could anything possibly go wrong with that? <laughs> uh, to be fair, it sounds like a devious plan. It does, yeah. But I, I swear I'm not doing that, guys. <laughs> yeah, we're we're playing a uh, a rescue. It's like we're trying to rescue our our hemp crops. Chat. What is what is hemp crops? Is that like is that the same as like marijuana's? Um, we'll back the music for me. Try to catch you guys at 2.30 when I get to the hotel. Sounds good there, Mr. Robert Z. We'll see you then there, buddy. Uh, Rye blew up another tanker, huh? I don't know what I did, but... All right, let me let me go check this out. It says we have to deliver hemp 
to the warehouse, guys. Let's go do that. So we're going to deliver hemp to the warehouse. Now, there is some guy, like, sitting here. I don't know. He looks like some sort of mafioso or something. I don't know what he's doing there. Should we talk to him, chat? I don't know if we should talk to him. Yeah, I just don't produce any flowers, says uh, Adam. <laughs> All right, sounds good there, buddy. Thank you very much there, Mr. Harry V. We got Riley coming in with a $5 super chat. Riley, thank you very much. I appreciate you, Riley. Says, hey, Ryan. Oh, here we go. Hey, Ryan, what did the farmer say when he lost one of his cows? What a mistake. That's not even, that's not even a joke, Riley. Over there. Hemp is oils related to Mary Jane. Okay, hemp is oils. Gotcha. Oils, chat. Oils, chat, oils. All right. Oh, this is a logistics center. Okay, it says logistics center. But it doesn't let me really do anything. It doesn't really let me do anything. Uh, oh, well, it's back. Hello again. Well, welcome back there, Hannah. Uh, the mob boss from yesterday came alone today because you didn't pay him. Oh, is that, is that who he is? So I don't know what this is either. This looks like this looks like some sort of like Colombian death trap or maybe something you'd find in Kim's basement. But I don't really know what that is, chat. What is that? Logitech Center. This Logitech Center? Oh, okay. Logitech Center. Uh, that was better than the pocket watch joke. It was, uh, Frank. You're, you're right. I'll, I'll be the first to admit it. All right. So it looks like we have this equipment here. We have this equipment here, which looks like some sort of uh, Colombian hemp harvester. So that's good. Uh, chop that corn up. Yeah. And we also have, I don't know. I don't know what this is. Like, what is this? I have no idea what this is, chat. Uh, that's a chopper. Oh, that's a chopper? I don't know what this is, chat. Skybury. What does that do? That is wild. This looks like the, the gates at the airport, like the metal detector you got to walk through. <laughs> no idea what that is. Uh, if you played FS22, you should know what that is. I played FS22, chat. I've never seen this before. I don't think I've ever seen this before, guys. That's for grapes. Well, I don't think we're doing any grapes today. It's a hemp, it's a hemp farm, guys. So we're doing like a hemp farm. That's the complaint department. Oh, it is? Okay. The complaint department. Gotcha. <laughs> Um, hi, Rye. What's up there, Dan Anderson? How you doing there, buddy? <clears throat> I thought you were already here there, buddy. Why are you saying hi, Rye, again? Uh, for tagged cattle. Oh, okay. All right, there we go. Dan, are you here or am I seeing things? I might be seeing things, chat. Hey, Rye, what's going on there, Mario? How you doing there, buddy? Why, did I cut out again? Are you guys, like, saying hello and goodbye? Am I, like, cutting out over and over? Hi, Rye, what's going on there, Tyler? How you doing there, buddy? <laughs> hi, Rye, what's going on, Deborah? Why are you guys all saying hi, Rye? What's happening? See if you notice my new profile pic. All right, let me look. Raya loves Farm Sim 22. Hold on a second, Dan. I just looked at your channel activity. Dan, you know you've been muted eight times in the past year? Oh, <laughs> my own moderator. Oh, wait, no, not muted. Wait, no, that's not muted. That's comments removed. I'm sorry. Wait, who hacked you? <laughs> Oh, no, no, that's mutes. That is mutes. Eight times you've been muted. Oh, my God. Nine. You <laughs> mean nine? No. It's been eight. Dan, my own moderator's been muted nine times? What? There's no way that's right, chat. Uh, yeah, it was all intense. Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah, mute game. That's right. Mute game. I forgot we played mute game. I keep forgetting about mute game, chat. Mute game kind of threw off the whole, like, universe here, chat. Uh, make it 10. <laughs> make it 10. I'm not going to make it 10, guys. Uh, yeah, I forgot about Mute 10. I always forget about that. Dan's definitely not as bad as his Mute record makes him out to be, guys. Uh, thank you very much there, Riley. Appreciate that support. Thank you, Harry, as well. You guys are awesome. Uh, boot game. Yeah, we got boot game, chat. Boot game. Um, all right. So, uh, deliver him to the warehouse. So, let me see here. Um, okay, so how do we do that, though? Like, how do we deliver hemp to the warehouse so let's go take a look at the warehouse and maybe see like if that's where we need to go because i don't know exactly like where my trailer is like do we need a trailer for that um you gotta remember i am new i am new to this game chat i do not know uh what's going on all i know is we have a time limit let me try and slow down time here can we slow down time no we can't oh my god we can't slow down time we have a time limit here chat and we can't slow down time why <laughs> Uh, right from you. No, no, no. Whoa. Chat. Just take a whiff of this. Oh. 
Oh, I bet that smells so good. I want some, says John Robitaille. Bruh. Bruh. Hello, Com Colombian Tomato Lord Rye. Oh. Oh. I'm home. I'm home, says <laughs> Kevin Armour. I don't know. Who said that? Jared. Jared says, oh, my God. Who said I'm home? <laughs> uh, I want some. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we got to save our harvest here, chat. Let's save our harvest, guys. Let's do it. All right. We got to go over here and save our harvest. Um, thank you very much, Riley. You're awesome. All right. Let me get up in here and see exactly what we need to do. There is a car over there. I don't know. Unload point. Okay. So that that is where we have to unload. So we just have to unload the hemp in the warehouse. That's what we have to do. Uh, those are Christmas trees, right? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. For any of the kids watching, those are just Christmas trees. Um, and we need to save them from the evil forest fire, which is raging in the background. Look at all that smoke in the background, chat. Right, I dropped a few matches. <laughs> I didn't drop any matches, chat. Uh, thank you very much, Riley. Thank you very much, Harry, as well. Um, that's a lot of tomato plants. It is, Lindsay. Yes, it is very, very much tomato plants. You're absolutely right. So let's go, uh, let's go harvest this. It's the Grinch that started the fire. Oh, the Grinch? The Grinch started the fire? <laughs> Uh, rage. Why Why we dropping rage there, Mr. Mr. Dwayne? Are you feeling ragey today, sir? Uh-oh. Oh, there's my trailer. Okay. They don't really tell you where things are at. We need, like, a map that tells you where things are at. Also, why is there music, like, blaring? I turned the music way down. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't turn it down enough. There we go. All right, now we got music chat. Blaring. Or not blaring. Not blaring. It's, like, the same. It's the same. Why is the music the same? All right. Why? Music's the same. Uh, Farm Sim has a map. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Farm Sim doesn't have a map in tents. You're lying, buddy. All right, let's get that going. Um, let's hook that up. Attach the trailer. Now, I'm not exactly sure what we're supposed to do. All it says is deliver hemp to the warehouse. Oh, it's the radio volume. Oh, radio volume. I didn't even see that. Okay, radio volume. All right, let's apply that. All right, let's do that. Ah, chat saves the day again, David. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Yeah, radio volume and music volume are two different things. All I had to do was look at it, and I couldn't do that simple task. <laughs> Farm Sim 22 does have a map. That's right there. Okay, so how do I harvest this stuff, though? Do I have to use that cruncher machine? Now, I don't even know what crops are, what fields are mine. Oh, I guess all four of these fields are mine. Oh, this is kind of cool. This is kind of cool, Ryan the Rookie. Yeah. So we'll do this. We'll do this smaller field first, uh, because it's close by. Um, and all right, let's just leave that here at the field, and then we'll run back over here, chat. Uh, Harry Vanola, happy day to you. Happy day to you as well, Mr. Harry Vanola. Farm Sim 22 has a radio on and off button, says Stephen. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, I bet this does, too. I bet it does, too. Uh, probably the chopper. Yeah. So, hopefully... Uh, see, the thing is, like, I don't see any, like, personal vehicle here. So, hopefully, we don't have to, like... Oh, yeah. I guess I could just fast travel. Oh, yeah. You can just fast travel. I forgot about that. How do I do that? Do this? Oh, yeah. You can just fast travel between your vehicles. That's right. All right. Let's try this thing. Should I try this thing? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. <laughs> uh, get through the chopper. Should I try this or the other thing, guys? What should I try? What should I try? Uh, this thing or the other thing, guys? There's another thing there. Uh, buy a truck, says Gregory. I don't even think there's a store in this area there, buddy. Way cooler than Farm Sim. Way better than Farm Sim. Definitely there, Marcus. Absolutely, my friend. Uh, this thing. All right, let's do this thing. So, apparently, this thing is the thing that we need to do to harvest here, chat. Other thing. <laughs> the other thing is a beast. Oh, that other thing is a beast too? Okay, well, let's try this thing first, and then we'll try the other thing. Uh, do you have a Cessna to deliver it? Uh, oh, haha, <laughs> Dan, that's good, buddy. Chat, hey, do I look like a dirty farmer that would secretly work for the cartel in Colombia? Really? Uh, good morning, Ryan and chat. What's going on there, buddy? Oh, you know what? Let me see if we can attach a trailer to this instead. Because that might be a little bit better. Let me see. Yes, for sure. Yes. <laughs> That's a lot of yeses, guys. That is a lot of yeses. 
David Durkin coming in with a three months of support. David, thank you very much there, buddy. He says, connect the trailer to the harvester. That's exactly what I'm going to do right now there, buddy. You read my mind, sir. You read my mind. That's probably popping up on your screen. Me doing that right now, my friend. Uh, turn the lights on. All right, we got the lights on. Thank you very much, though, David. You're absolutely right. We're going to connect the trailer to the harvester itself. El Bozo. El Bozo. El Bozo. All right, let me get around to the left. Son of a stink. Can't get through here. Dang it. Uh, hello, Riot. What's going on there, Philip Ennis? How you doing there, buddy? Good to see you, my friend. Thank you very much for being here. We got this, says Tobias. All right, we got this there, buddy. We absolutely got this. Um, let's let's hook up this trailer. Hey, Slacker. What's up there, Shawnee? How you doing there, sir? Um, we're going to attach that trailer up. Let's do it. Riot Chapo says Mosin. I am Riot Chapo. What's going on my sound? It sounds like an airplane's passing by or something. Uh, Riot for Rikers. <laughs> what is Rikers? Isn't that like a New York prison? Um, we got uh, Lindsay coming in with the 11 months of red level. Red level supporter Lindsay. Thank you very much for that. It says last day in, F in Florida. Um, sitting in my empty house watching Raya. Oh, I bet that's a weird feeling. Um, can't think of a better way to get out, to go out, keep doing what you do, right? I love it. Love. Hold on a second. Love you all and chat. Um, here we come, Phoenix. Aw, that's awesome. You know what, Lindsay? I know it's a bittersweet feeling. Like, you don't want to leave, but you're ready for new adventures in life. But just embrace it. Just embrace it. I know it's hard. Um, but you know, Florida is always going to be there, uh, if you ever need to go back, you know, but just try to, try to do your best and embrace the new uh, adventure. I'm sure you already are, but that sounds very, very exciting there, uh, Lindsay. And I wish the best for you for sure. No hurricanes in Arizona and there's no hurricanes in Arizona, but there is like excruciating heat in Arizona. I think, I think pretty much anywhere you go, there's always some sort of crappy weather, unless you live like on the California coast. Uh, but even California has to deal with like forest fires and stuff. So like nowhere is perfect. You know, <laughs> it's weird having an empty head of hair too. Yeah. I also have an empty head of hair so I can relate to the empty house. All right. Let me see here. Move device down. Um, and work mode. Nice. All right. So let's give this a shot here, chat. Let's see what happens. Stinking stupid jerk game. Yeah! What's up, Andrew? Press R. Oh, yeah. Turn it on. Yeah, I forgot to turn it on. <laughs> I forgot to turn it on. There it goes. Whoa. Bro. Bro. Look at all this marijuanas. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Oh, sha -la -la -la. Sha -la -la -la. Why is there a timer for 12 minutes in the corner there, chat? Uh, Aviator Mike says, coming from Oregon. I didn't know they had machines that could harvest cannabis. Apparently they do. This is like Columbia. So this is like some next level uh, harvesting we have to do here, chat. We have four giant fields of marijuanas. Um, I sure will, John Colley. Uh-oh. What, what happened now? All right. Let's get around here, chat. We got to get around here, guys. Get around. Uh, hemp is not Mary Jane. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're right. That's right. It is not Mary Jane, chat. You're right. We, we got to call it by what it is. I uh, hope you keep the stems and seeds to a minimum. <laughs> all right. Let's just uh, suckle all this down here, chat. Now, we are in a hurry. We got no time for shenanigans, chat. Uh, we harvest in a different way. Oh, do you there, Mr. Uh, Arno? Okay. You guys, so Oregon um, harvests in a different way than this. So there are multiple ways to harvest this type of plant. Uh, that's the timer before the Fed show. <laughs> no, that time, I think there's a, I think that timer is until the forest fire comes and destroys all my crops. As you can see, there's a looming fire in the background coming for me, and it's uh, destroying my crops. I think we have to save at least, like, 38,000 pounds of this or something like that. So we have to, like, save as much of this as we can, guys. Uh, all that salad. I know, yeah. So we're, we got to save what we can, chat. So we're doing our best here, chat. We're doing our best. We're doing our best. Uh, that's accurate for Oregon. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Oregon's a little bit different there, chat. Um, hemp doesn't produce the flower. Oh, really? So it's just like the, what, like the stems and the, or like the seeds? Or no, no. What would the, what would hemp be then? Would that just be the, um, what would that be? Would that just be like the, the, the vine or something? Uh, the vine and the leaf? I don't know. So it doesn't produce the flower. Okay. 
Hello, Ryan Chat. I miss you all. What's up there, Al? How you doing there, buddy? Good to see you, my friend. I bet the village would not mind uh, if the field burned. That's true, yeah. Uh, that's one week's worth for Snoop, though. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Well, that's probably true. I see Raya return to farm sim. This is not farm sim, guys. We are trying to save our hemp plants in Colombia uh, from being destroyed. So we have to save. I don't know exactly how much we're supposed to save here, but we have to save as much as we can. Hemp is the male plant. Oh, okay. So marriage one is the female plant. I got you. That makes sense. Guys, tap that like. We are almost at 200 likes on the stream. Um, Tobias says they make paper, clothes, hemp, crete, rope from hemp. Oh, really? Oh, okay. That's interesting. Yeah, I did not know that. So they make a lot of other things from hemp. Okay, the storage is now full. So, um, all right, let's just drop this off. I'm going to stop the working device. Instead of, like, hooking up to my tractor, which is, like, equally slow, I'm going to stop the working part of this and then uh, head on over and drop it off, chat. Uh, don't forget to like the stream. Yeah, thank you, Denver. I appreciate that. We got Jonathan Fanning. Oh, my goodness. Jonathan. Thank you, brother, for the super chat there, buddy. Says, how are you, sir? Thanks for all the streams. Enjoy watching them. Thank you, buddy. I, thank you, man. I appreciate that, buddy. I do. Thank you for the support there, sir. I'm glad you enjoyed the stream, my friend. You're awesome. Thank you for the support. Uh, thank you for the $20 super chat, sir. Um, I, I, I'm glad you're here there, Jonathan. You're awesome there, buddy. All right, let's try and unload this now. So I guess we have to drop this off. And I'm not sure how much we have to drop it off, but it can hold 110,000 pounds of it. Uh, hey, Ryan Chat. What's up there, Tyran? How you doing there, buddy? Good to see you as well. That timer is making me a little bit nervous, though, chat. All right. It's oh, you know what? You know what? That's rope hemp. Okay, so that's rope hemp. Gotcha, gotcha. We already have 55%. Uh, it's saying on my little bar up there, chat. So we might only need to do, like, two swaths of this. Uh, and now it's saying, oh, I didn't see that either. There's coffee, too. So there's hemp and coffee. Hemp uh, paper, hemp burgers, hemp concrete. Hemp burgers? Wait a minute. You can make burgers out of this? Ugh. What do you mean hemp burgers? Wait a second. What do you mean hemp burgers? All right, where was that field that I was doing? Oh, yeah, it's over here. It's over here. Ah, uh, countdown to burn down. Yeah, we got countdown to burn down, chat. <laughs> we gotta hurry up. We definitely gotta hurry up. Uh, just cheat like usual. Take the timer off. I'm not cheating there, buddy. Let me see here. So, work and start the machine. Drop it down. Start the machine. There we go. Now we're doing it. Now we're doing it. Uh, that was two levels of the challenge. First level was 30k. Second part was 90k. Oh, really, Marcus? Oh, my goodness, buddy. I'm not doing a very good harvest here, then. <laughs> Son of a stink. Uh, Jonathan, thank you very much there, buddy. Uh, says, how are you, sir? Oh, yeah. I read that. Thank you there, sir. Uh, we got Hannah coming in as well with the six months. Hannah with the six months. Thank you very much, Hannah. Appreciate that. Says, probably overdue, given that I've been missing. Um, but happy to be here this long. Can't wait for more streams and more van videos. Thank you. Oh, chat, can one of the moderators possibly uh, drop the comment of the of the link for the van video page? So I am going to be posting all my van videos on the new channel, chat. I'm no longer going to be posting them on the Raya Stream channel, okay? Uh, this channel is not really the right place for it. So if you guys want to follow the van videos, um, make sure you uh, follow that van page, guys. That's where all the new van videos are going to be. Thank you very much, Dan Danison. I appreciate that. I'm going to pin that. So if you guys want to click on that pin message and go follow that page, uh, just click subscribe and turn on all notifications. That's where all the future van stuff is going to be, guys. Um, and not like the tomatoes you grew on that other game. That's true, Rudy. Yes. <laughs> uh, Dan needs muted for dropping a link. <laughs> Dan dropped the link. All right. Should I give him his ninth mute? I'm sorry, Dan. I got to do this, buddy. You broke the rules, sir. <laughs> so thank you, Trips. Yeah. I appreciate that, my friend. I wanted to do it all in one channel, but then I realized there's just way too many uh, people that follow this channel. They're just completely checked out of the stream, and all that's going to do is hurt. So if I could get a new channel for people that are actually interested in the van stuff, uh, maybe that one will do better, guys. So hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Um, Deborah's laughing for some reason. I <laughs> mean, Kyle. Oh, no. Dan, Kyle's giving bad ideas. Uh... <laughs> I'm not going to be Dan chat. No, all he's doing is helping out today. He's being very helpful today. 
Uh, get some mute for doing shit. <laughs> I know. I didn't say it. Kyle kept saying it. I was just reading Kyle's comment. But you're right. When was the, when was the last time I, I thought listening to Kyle was a good idea? I don't even know. All right, we're going to have to start doing this, like, correctly here, Chad. I've, been, I've just been kind of, like, going in circles. But you got to remember, we are trying to save as much hemp as possible. So it's not about doing a nice, neat, complete job. It's about saving as much hemp as possible before the fire comes and kills us. Uh, Dan's icon is so true. It is. Yeah, you're absolutely right. No, no, it's not true at all. <laughs> all right, let me go to, or let me um, turn that off. Okay, let's turn that off. We do get a little bit more speed when we turn off the harvester, so that's good. Uh, Frosty would have fired you already. He would have, yeah, but luckily, uh, you know, he lives in GTA now, Chad. He's nowhere to be found. <laughs> uh, off the rails, right. That's right there, Mr. Uh, Oliver. Uh, let's get in here, guys, and let's dump this crop. Since you said to follow your other channel, you gained 10 subs. That's awesome. Thank you, chat. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. Yeah, that's where I'm going to be, chat, from now on, guys. This channel is going to be um, just mostly covering new game releases from now on. And then uh, that channel is going to be for all the van stuff, chat. So, yeah. All right, let me see here. So, we're going to dump this. H, dump. Uh, Jason Bergerman, thank you for the 18 months of support there, buddy. I appreciate it. Oh, I'm hitting all the wrong buttons. <laughs> all the wrong buttons. Uh, thank you very much. Jason says hemp has been less than 3% THC and can make paper, clothing, textiles, animal feed, plastic products like hemp seed, milk, or oil, protein powder. Oh, really there, buddy? Oh, huh. so it has a lot of uses. So hemp has like a ton of uses. Okay, I got you there, buddy. That is awesome, my friend. Um, thank you for the, for, the, for the lesson there, sir. I appreciate you. All right, let's get down here, guys. Ben was dropping the band stickers. Uh, what up, Ryan Chat? What's up there, Dylan? Good to see you there, buddy. Ryan making big packs. <laughs> yeah, this is like Maul Bazal. Oh man, why is it? Uh oh, why is this only saying 55% still? Bro, the percentage didn't go up. What? What? How do I open the tablet again? What's the tablet? Oh, V's the tablet. Okay. How do I look at the challenge? Just keep going. Hold on. Let me look. Uh, where's the challenge at? How do I look at the challenge? Uh, activities and drone. Drone starting. Wait, I have a drone? Dude, I had a drone and I didn't even know because the coffee's the other 45% bozo. Yeah, but it doesn't say go deliver the coffee now. What is this? <laughs> Dude, I didn't even know there was a drone in this game. Insufficient funds, what does that mean? Whoa, this is freaking awesome, dude. Uh, sweet, yeah. Uh, all right, how do I, how do I activate night vision? Whoa! Now I can see beds closing in. Yeah, it's like my security drone here, chat. Uh, how do I get out of the drone view? Uh... Okay, place marker, zoom in and out. Okay, so you can like place mark. Wow, this is crazy, chat. All right, how do I? Okay, turn off the drone is V. Okay, so the drone is now landing. <laughs> Farm Sim has a drone. Farm Sim doesn't have a drone, Dwayne. You're lying, buddy. Chat, does Farm Sim have a drone? Push V. I'm just trying to find where my. Like, where does it tell me the challenge? Deliver hemp to the warehouse. I already did that. I delivered so much hemp to the warehouse. No, it doesn't. You guys are saying it does. <laughs> Farm Sim does not have a drone. Yeah, Farm Sim does not have a drone, chat. Maybe I didn't unload it in the right place or something. Uh, oh, 32%. Okay, we're only at 32% on this. I don't know why. I'm just going to keep on going, though, and we'll see what happens. Uh, Farm Sim 22 has flight mode. Okay, they have flight mode, which is not a drone. Yeah, I got you. Um, if Farm Sim had a drone, yeah, the drone DLC would be $30, Chad, if Farm Sim had a drone, guys. It would not have a drone. Um, it's $30 drone DLC. Exactly. <laughs> no, but they have a helicopter. Oh, they do have a helicopter. Okay, I didn't know they had a helicopter. Are you sure that's not a mod, Tracy? Because every time I had to use a helicopter in that, um, I had to use a mod, buddy. It was not in the game itself, but you never know, Chad. Maybe it is. Right, let's do this, guys. There we go. It's beginning, it's beginning to be nighttime, though. Uh, flight mode and flight sim has night vision. Really, Lindsay? Okay, so there is a flight mode in farming simulator, and it does have night vision. That's kind of cool. That is cool. 
Uh, it's because you meet minimum requirements, the hemp side, the challenge. Or the hemp side, the challenge. Oh, I did. Okay. So, well, it's still saying deliver hemp to the warehouse. So, maybe we just need to work on coffee then. Uh, everything we're doing in Farm Sim is a mod. Exactly there, Infernal. You're right, buddy. <laughs> You're absolutely right. You might... See, now, like, I think the people that play Farm Sim, they don't even remember what's a mod and what isn't. Because there's, like, that... The only reason that game's still alive is because of the mods. So, like, I think everyone thinks that, like, mod stuff is actual game stuff now. <laughs> Which, you know, it is. It is and it isn't. Uh, we got Whiskey Shooter coming up with a $10 Super Chat. Whiskey Shooter. Thank you so much for the support, buddy. It says, first, I need a bigger SSD for all the games. Now I need a van. <laughs> I know, buddy. I know. The Life of Raya is a very scatterbrained one. There's a lot of uh, different things that I like to do there, buddy. <laughs> I don't like doing the same thing, you know? Uh, fire, fire, fire. Yeah, the fire's coming in. So the fire is... Whoa, look at that sunset over there. That is beautiful in the background. We're, we must be on, like, the Colombian coast here, chat. Thank you very much there, Whiskey Shooter, for the support there, buddy. We got Dan Shaw as well. Dan Schaub coming in with a massive $2 super chat. Says, Ryan has a DLC called Bozo Van. I mean, Van Ran Riot DLC. Thank you, buddy. That was that was almost something. <laughs> All right, let me uh, let me dump this. We're going to dump that chat. And I'm guessing... No, now it's going up again. Did I dump it in the wrong spot? I probably dumped it in the wrong spot, didn't I? Yeah. Just send the Ryan invoice. <laughs> yeah, just send me an invoice, chat. It'll get paid, I promise. <laughs> um, thank you very much there, Dan Chubb. Uh, you might have, says Dan. I think I dumped it in the wrong spot. Well, that's a big waste of time. <laughs> that was a big waste of time. Son of a stink. Yeah, you probably did. I probably did. I was like, yeah, there's no way that we're done with the hemp harvest already. Um... But apparently I dumped it in the wrong spot, guys. All right, let's go harvest some more. Guys, you think we're going to make this? You think we're going to successfully do this challenge? Um, we have seven minutes to get all of this hemp and all of this coffee harvested up and, uh, and dumped, chat. You guys think we're going to make the harvest? We have seven minutes and, and ten seconds there. Although time is going kind of slow for some reason. I don't know why it's going so slow. Uh, no. <laughs> no. It is going slow, though. Why is time going so slow? That's kind of weird. Um, that is weird, though. Doesn't it look like it's going, like, slower than normal? Drunk Holly believes. Thank you, Drunk Holly. I knew somebody would believe in me. Not a chance. Nah, we're going to make it. We're going to make it, chat. Yeah, you ain't kidding, Dylan. Mark Adams says maybe it was somebody else doing it. Who? Who could do this faster, chat? Who volunteers? <laughs> Uh, yes, you won't, says David. No, we're gonna make it there, buddy. We gotta make it. So we got, all we gotta do is, um, like, 37% more hemp, and then, uh, we gotta do, I think, um, all of the coffee. I don't know where the coffee is, chat. <laughs> no idea where the coffee is. Uh, Dan Shop, thank you very much there, buddy. Whiskey Shooter as well. Uh, Dwayne says I could. Oh, really? Oh, you could? Okay. Kyle could? Oh, Kyle could? Dan, um, Smith. All right, Kyle, hop on in there, buddy. Nathan could? Nathan don't even show up no more. <laughs> he doesn't even exist. Um, my seven-year-old could do it faster, says Patrick. Oh, really there, buddy? Uh, that's interesting. Uh, Intense could. He's a great farmer. He doesn't even farm on Farm Sim. He doesn't even farm. He just builds stuff and digs in the dirt. <laughs> he doesn't even farm. Uh, Team Ryan. Thank you there, Dominic. I think I'm the only farmer left. Chat. I'm the only farmer left. Frosty quit. Intense doesn't farm. I'm the last farmer, chat. The last farmer. Uh, she's drunk. Who's drunk? <laughs> Sorry I had you on mute. What happened? Don't worry about it, Kyle. It's not important there, buddy. It's not important. We're just trying to see who could do this and who can't. Um, last time I played this, I did it in five minutes. He, Lindsay, you've never played this before. <laughs> Lindsay's like, last time I played it, I did it in five minutes. There's no way you've ever played this game. Nobody even knew this game existed. Uh, Coop, farming was... This week, I think. Uh, he, he hasn't played Farming Simulator in literally forever, chat. Uh, Raya still on Farmers Only. I'm not on Farmers Only, guys. Uh, yeah, I'm a pro farmer. Exactly there, Kyle. Yeah, yeah, you are. All right, let's get the rest of this weed farm, chat. Now, I think we do. We probably don't even need to, like, do a whole batch. Uh, but we're going to do a whole batch anyway because we're at 63% here. 
Uh, Coop played this like two days ago. Oh, Coop played this game? Oh, really? <clears throat> yeah, quit quit saying that, Harry. We don't we don't mention those people's names in here, chat. Uh, <laughs> I can do in two minutes, says Brad. <laughs> uh, Marcus Bell says Coop upgraded from farm sim to this. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, I don't. I must have missed that stream. I had no idea he played this chat. Uh, I'm very sad that my save file is not working though. Uh, my save file is not working. I played this game nearly six years ago. Really, David? That's pretty cool, buddy. I like that. I like that they actually have like the challenges there, buddy. I like the challenges. Um, Corey Salisbury, thank you for the 19 months of support there, my friend. I appreciate that. This hi Ryan in chat. Hope all is well. What's going on there, Mr. Corey? Thank you for the 19 months as well, there, buddy. You're awesome. Appreciate that, sir. Uh, it's dark. Can you make it light? No, I can't. We're in a, we're in a challenge. I tried to speed up time, but you can't speed up uh, time in a challenge. So we're just gonna have to deal with the darkness here, Chad. I'll, I'll keep it in like first person view, so we can just like see what's going on in front of us. Uh, farm hemp stream. <laughs> yeah. So this is like a challenge. So it's like a timed challenge. So we have so much time before the forest fire engulfs us in flames here, Chad. That's what we're doing right now. Uh, does the tractor have a high gear? Uh, it does. Yeah, well, no, I gotta... Let's see if I can turn this off. I like how everyone's asking me, like, hurry up in a farming game. Like, you know farming games aren't fast, right, chat? Like, farming equipment isn't like isn't like a Ferrari. <laughs> you guys know that, right? Uh, do you need to save yourself right? It's like SnowRunner. It's like telling me to go 100 miles an hour in SnowRunner. It's just not gonna happen, chat. It's farm equipment. You don't, you don't speed it up. You just go slow. <laughs> uh, only played it 50 minutes. Oh, that explains it, David. Okay, I got you, buddy. <laughs> Farming equipment is made by Lamborghini. That's true. Actually, you're right, Tyler. Uh, Lamborghini. Oh, we're at 90 percent. Ah, damn it! 90 percent. How did I not fill this thing up yet? Yeah. Chad, we got five minutes. Five minutes <laughs> left on this challenge. A tractor has a high gear. Oh, that's true, Tobias. Yeah. Tractors do have high gears, but this tractor, this isn't a tractor. This is a harvester. What did Denver say? Uh, add a turbo to it. I would if I could, Hannah. Trust me. Let me see. There we go. That coffee screwed. I think the coffee might burn, Chad. I don't think we're going to finish this challenge. I don't think they give me enough time, guys. Uh, we are not going to finish this challenge. <laughs> Chat, please do not drop ads for farmers only in the Discord right now. I mean, I know we're playing a farm game, but uh, that's not exactly... This, this isn't a dating simulator. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, we got Harry Vanola. Harry V. Thank you for the 100 Swedish kroner there, buddy. I appreciate that. Harry Vanola. Thank you for the massive support there, sir. What is he saying? What is that? Oh, he's dropping like a Superman. Oh, thank you, Harry. Thank you, buddy. He's dropping a Superman. That's awesome. Thank you very much, buddy. Uh, Ferrari started a car brand um, and then made a tractor uh, or two fifty seven. Uh, Lambo started his tractors. Oh, really? Okay, I got you there, Dan Schaub. I got you, buddy. Um, it does suck that it's dark. I didn't realize this challenge was going to be started in the evening time. Wonder why they would do that. Why wouldn't they just start the challenge in the morning? I guess you can't really time out forest fires. I guess you there's not like a convenient time for them. Uh, you missed a spot. Oh, we missed a lot of spots. All I'm trying to do is get this filled up enough so we can start on the coffee, guys. Uh, we need to get that coffee. You talked too long. I did, Harry, or Dan, yeah. I did. I talked too long at the beginning. I didn't realize we had a timer on. Um, and I wasted all of our time. <laughs> um, let's see here. What is this? All right. All right. Now, Matt, who photoshopped Farming Simulator 23 logo? First of all, there is no Farming Simulator 23. Is there? Wait, is there a Farming Simulator 23? Maybe I'm wrong. Um, <laughs> Tobias. Son of a stink whistle. Wait, is there a farming simulator 23? No, there isn't. Maybe that's like the mobile version or something. No reading Discord and driving at the same time. I'm sorry, chat. I'm just trying to get these scraps up right now. The audacity. The audacity! 
I gotta get these scraps, guys. We need these scraps. Oh, here's a big chunk of scraps right here. Look at these scraps. Uh, Farm Sim 23 is for Nintendo. Oh, that's for Nintendo Switch. That's right. That's the mobile version, yeah. Because they, uh, for some reason, they do, like, off years as mobile versions. Even though there was never a Farm Sim 24, so that's interesting. Do you guys think there's going to be a Farm Sim 25? Is there any, like, inkling about the next Farm Sim? Have they even, like, teased it or talked about it at all? Or has there been any rumors or anything? Um, guys, tap that like as well. You guys are doing good on likes today. Thank you very much, chat. Um, I have n I have not heard anything about a new Farm Sim, guys. I sure hope not, says Deborah. <laughs> Um, this year. Oh, this year? No, Oliver. No, there better not be. Uh, it will be in VR. Oh, VR farm sim? Really? A VR farm sim. That is interesting. Next one will be 25. Yeah, I'm thinking farm sim 25. I don't think they're going to drop one this year. They probably would have already teased it. Uh, yeah, they'll do it. They'll do, they'll do one in farm sim 25 because they need a little bit of time to go by before they release the same game again. I think people are starting to like wake up and realize that they've just received, you know, They've been buying the same game over and over and again since Farm Sim 15. So I think they need a little time to go by, and then everyone will get all excited, like, oh, Farm Sim 25, and it'll still be the same game again. I uh, don't think the last one picked up enough steam uh, to earn a new one yet. That's true. Yeah, you might be right. You might be right there, buddy. Um, yeah, big changes. They're changing 22 to 25. <laughs> exactly, yeah, but uh, I'm hoping. No, don't get me wrong, Chad. I'm not trying to be a, 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 a hatery, hatery do. But I will say this, I hope that Giants eventually does, you know, take their billions of dollars and finally make a di like a, a new engine or a new game. That would be amazing. I really hope that they do. I think the Farm Sim fans deserve that, even though they probably don't know any better. Uh, they deserve that chat. And I think we all deserve a fresh, uh, new, up-to-date engine in physics, guys. Uh, going to come out with GTA 6. Oh, maybe, yeah. Farm Sim 2030 will be remotely driving real equipment. That would be kind of cool there, Justin. Although, dude, could you, Justin, could you imagine that dystopian future? That is like a dystopian world future. Think about this. Farming simulator driving real vehicles. So real farms in like Germany fire all their workers you pay for farming simulator. You pay $50 to drive real farm equipment and do real farming. Oh, my God. Could you imagine that? That is like an episode of Black Mirror. But, like, you don't know you're doing that. Like, it feels like a game. Meanwhile, they've just got a bunch of cameras set up streaming to your PC. Oh, my God. That sounds like a disaster. It would be a disaster. That'd be carnage. That would be insane, though. Could you imagine that? Uh, better have good insurance. Oh, man. Could you imagine that? Car crashes. Yeah. So, so here's what you do. They, what they would, I think what they would have to do is, like, make it so it's a simulator at first. So, like, you would do the simulated at first. But then all the top tier, like, like they have a competition, like a farm sim tournament for, to see who, like, the best farmer is. And then they get those best farmers to do the actual real thing. That would be insane. So, like, you think you're just, like, competing to be a really good farmer, but meanwhile, you're actually harvesting real crops. <laughs> that would be so wild. Uh, SSTP, thank you for the one gifted sub. We got SSTP dropping a gifted buddy. Thank you, sir. Now, it's saying SSTP on my screen dropped, like, 100 gifteds. Did SSTP drop, like, 101 gifted sub bombs? Because my screen showed up a 1,000 times for that. What the heck is going on with, with YouTube today? Why are they so screwed up? Uh, you would fail, yeah. <laughs> he just dropped one. Yeah, he dropped one. But it, on my screen, it's showing that he dropped like 100 of them. There's like 100 uh, drops from them. It's all the same one drop. It's like, what? <laughs> no, you only dropped one there, SSTP. <laughs> SSTP's like, oh, God, my bank. No, you only dropped one because it, it went to the same person. It went to Kevin Arbor. It went to Kevin Arbor. You only dropped one. It's like, oh, God. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. It was obviously a glitch on my end. It was definitely a YouTube glitch. Okay. All right. Let's go de deliver this. Wait, why are we? Dude, why is the hemp still at 98%? Oh, my God. Way to make him poop himself. I'm sorry. Why is the hemp still at 98%? What is happening? The matrix is failing. It is. Uh -oh. Did you guys hear an explosion? Where's the field at? Okay, there's the field. 
Let me make brighter lights. Those are my brightest lights. Uh, because the last load was only 7%. Okay. So we should probably go to another field is what you're saying. Let me check my map here. Oh, yeah. That field's cleaned out. Let's go up here to this field then. Or what is this field? Field number three. Your property. What is it, though? I need to know what it is. Uh, could the same ATS driver... No, I don't think that would work good for ATS there, buddy. ATS is a little bit too... You know, it, it's hard to control, um, you know, for, for guys like me. <laughs> uh, other than... Re like, real-life truck driving is a lot easier than ATS, guys. Um, it is very realistic. Don't get me wrong. It's just, like... It's just not the same. Um, all right. So, that is... Okay, that's coffee. All right. This is... This must be hemp. This got to be hemp over here. Uh, Wayne Roberts dropping the kitty cats. Thank you there, buddy. Okay, so let's go over here. Uh, how do I make a little marker? Okay, let's go over here and place that marker. We're going to get that last one. Accident detected. Exactly. Uh, thank you very much, Harry Vanola, for that massive drop there, buddy. I appreciate you. You are amazing, sir. And thank you very much, SSTP, for the one gifted. We also have Harry V with the $20. Or 20 Swedish crowner. Thank you very much there, buddy. It says ATS remote as well, but not for me. <laughs> Chad, if ATS was remote... Control, do you think that they would let me drive it? You think SCS software would let me drive a remote control real vehicle? I think, I honestly, I think they would. I think they would trust me enough. Uh, as long as there wasn't a chat. Like, it would have to be illegal to stream it, you know? You, like, you shouldn't be able to stream that. Uh, oh, says uh, Oliver. Yeah. So, like, streaming that should be, like, illegal, probably. But I don't think it should be, like, totally illegal for me. Uh, ATS is too hard on Red Jeeps. That's true there, Lori. Um, heck no. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. All right. Fine, chat. Uh, thank you very much there, Mr. Harry V. Uh, we got Bill Hildeman as well. Bill Hildeman coming to that 16 months. Thank you, Bill. Says, as long as they don't let Raya drive trains remotely, explosion in 3, 2, 1. That's a good idea. I'll stop driving if so is Danny Smith. <laughs> Danny Smith. Uh, what are you doing with your hemp? So we're storing it. Because apparently there's a fire, there's like a raging forest fire coming, and it's threatening to destroy all of my crops. And uh, we're trying to get it all into the warehouse before the fire hits. So in a desperate attempt to save our crops there, guys. So we have a minute and 12 seconds to do it. Um, obviously, that timer is going very, very slow for some reason. Um, but yeah, we have about a minute left here, chat. So hopefully we get it all in there. Uh, Justin Bairdsford says, hello, Harry Vanola, my good friend. Uh, fire in the hemp field. Oh, we got a fire in the hemp field? Okay. All right, let's uh, let's get over here, chat. Um, shipping it over the border to the USA, says Oliver. <laughs> All right, let's get over here, guys, and let's do it. Uh, this game looks better than Farm Sim. It, I, I, honestly, Dylan, I'm not going to say it's better than Farm Sim, um, even though I want to really, really bad. Uh, I will say this. It is definitely a fully functional farming simulator. And not only that, there are some unique things in this game, like the story mode, the challenges that we've done um there are some things that i think really do shine in this game um it got written off back in the day because it came out in 2018 which was a really bad time to drop this i feel like if this game came out today it would be massive but uh it came out in the peak of farming simulator it came out between farming simulator 17 and farming simulator uh 19 which were arguably the most uh the best farming simulators so, you know, I mean, it came out in a bad time at the peak of Farm Sim, so it didn't really get very good. But, like, now I think if it came out, I think it would do a lot better than it did. Uh, the drone will sell it for something, yeah. But now the problem is now it's an abandoned game. So, like, there's no... Wait, unload area. Oh, I've been dropping this in the middle! I've been dropping this in the middle! That's why... <laughs> oh, my God! Hold on. Oh, wait. I am supposed to drop it. All right. Okay. All right. We got it. The middle's where it goes. No, it goes here. It goes here. <laughs> Dang it. Dang it. It goes on that line. It's supposed to go on that line. All right. Now we got to get the coffee. Let's go get that coffee, chat. <laughs> I think I screwed it up. Did I really screw it up that bad? How did I screw up that bad, chat? That's impossible. Uh, Welp says, uh, no, 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 no whelps, chat. No whelps. Um, uh-oh, that fire is getting close. <laughs> uh, rip farm. No, 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 no. No rip farm, chat. No rip farm, guys. All right, we're going to get it. We're going to get it, chat. We'll get it, guys. 
All right, let's go. Now what we have to do is we have to go get the coffee. So let's go save the coffee now. Uh, Welp says Lindsay. Welp indeed. Uh, bye bye farm. The middle of the Willie Nelson area. <laughs> All right, so there's, it's saying the, oh, that's my marker. I'm sorry, that was my marker. All right, let's go over here to our area and let's go get that uh, coffee bean machine, guys. Yeah, we need the other thing now. So you guys think we need the other thing to harvest the coffee, uh, Harry? Okay, let's go over there and get that other thing. Let's get a couple of hashtag rise other thing. Um, challenge lost. This is impossible. Yeah, I ran out of time. You know what? That one was stupid anyway. Dang it! <laughs> uh, you just burn. You did you just burn? I just burned. Yeah, we burned down to the ground. Uh, what have we learned, chat? Yes, what have we learned, guys? Did we learn anything? Um, <laughs> did I learn anything? My coffee. I'm sorry. Dang it. All right, let's get some coffee cups in the chat. All the coffee got burned. We saved the hemp, though. Can we at least get some green dings for the hemp? The hemp got saved. The coffee did not. Let's get some coffee cups for the coffee. Rise, little thing. Yeah, Colombian coffee will be no, no more, chat. Dang it. Dang it. All right, which one you want to do? You want to do white gold? In Japan, you want to do Sunny Harvest in Montana. That sounds dumb. All right, so Italy or Japan, chat. Italy, olive tasting or white gold? What do you want to do? Olive tasting or white gold? Which one do you want to do, chat? So we could do the rice um, in Japan, guys, or we could do uh, Italy's olives, chat. Uh, white gold, white gold. All right, let's do white gold. You guys are saying white gold? Japan, Japan. All right, Japan four. Here we go, chat. Here we go. Um, rice is one of the main basic foods and are produced in a large scale in Japan. It's an ingredient in virtually every dish on the menu in the land of the cherry blossom. Uh, rice fields must be heavily watered, which makes working the fields rather difficult. Uh, the, the local farmers are asking your help for a difficult plowing process. All right, we got to do some difficult plowing chat. So let's go to Japan and plow. Uh, requirements are plow 60% of each of the three fields. Um, it's just plowing. Is this just plowing? That's not the white gold I was thinking. <laughs> no, no. Don't tell me this is just a plowing mission. Big man Japan, yeah. Uh, thank you very much there, Bill Hildeman and Harry Vanola. Appreciate the love. I want to do some plowing in Japan, too. All right, let's do some plowing in Japan, guys. Let's do it. Whoa. Dude, look at this scenery. Oh, this is kind of cool. How come the same grumpy puss is in every area here, chat? The same, like... Russian businessman. <laughs> uh, I love the plow. Yeah, me too there, guys. All right, let's head on over here, chat, and let's do this challenge. <gasps> oh, I was hoping we could drive it. Yeah! Uh, what's wrong with plowing? I did that last night. Uh, I mean, plowing's kind of slow and boring, <laughs> but we'll give it a shot. Uh, we'll give it a shot, guys. Let's do it. So we'll turn on that beacon. Gotta have that beacon, chat. Drive the van in Japan. That would be awesome. Look at this, uh, look at this little tractor, though. This thing's cool. I like this. The little fast little guy. All right, let's attach the rear device and plow these fields, chat. Uh, someone got to do it. Somebody's got to do it, chat. Um, all right, let's get out here and do it. I mean, if we, if we win the challenge, at least we get to go on to the next challenge. So that would be cool. Uh, it depends on what type of plowing you are talking about. That's true, yeah. Dude, this looks awesome, actually. Like, this looks really, really cool. So let me see. Let me get familiar with the map here. Um, and it looks like, let me see here. Uh, okay, that, that, and that. Why are there two, why are there different color? Do I have to plow all three fields? Plow three fields. Oh, they're small. Oh, okay, they're small. All right, we should be able to do these. Uh, difficult plowing, yeah. So we'll go, we'll turn around and we'll go down this way, chat. Let's go down this way, guys. Yeah, there, there's a field down there. There's a field down there. Uh, start number one. Well, we're going to start down this way there, Tobias. But I appreciate this. <laughs> Tobias! Start number one. Yeah, number one seems like a smart thing to start at. You're right. <laughs> You're absolutely right. 
All right. Um, I like the guy, or I like a guy who knows what they're doing when they plow, says Lindsay. Lindsay, you can't say that here. Jeez. Where's Holly at? Dude, look at the, look at this. Is that, are those fields or what are those? These are fields? Why are they all wet? Uh, gotcha. <laughs> gotcha says, uh, wait, why are these fields all wet? Whoa. Dude, look how wet this is. Ooh, it's so wet and slippery. Look how wet this field is. Whoa. Whoa, there's some guy walking around too. Bro, why is this field so wet? Uh, look how wet and slippery it is. Oh my goodness, chat. Why is it so wet? Oh, I almost took that girl's head off. All right, there we go. Dude, that is wild. I don't... See, Farm Sim doesn't have this. Farm Sim doesn't have this. Hey. Hey, Farm Sim fans. Does Farm Sim have wet fields? I don't think so. Uh, first time I plowed something wet. <laughs> Stop it. All right, let me, uh, let me rotate. Or no, we don't want to rotate it. Uh, we want to move the device down. So Z. Okay, there we go. All right, there we go, chat. Wow. So so rice fields are like very wet. That is crazy. Uh, Drunk Holly's like, I'm being good today. <laughs> Wait, why is it only... Hold on, let me rotate this. Why is it only plowing like one line? Don't tell me it's going to only plow like one row. Oh, unfold... Oh, I never unfolded it. Oh, whoops. <laughs> unfolded both. Oh, yeah. I never unfolded it. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Jesus Christ is Denver. I'm sorry. All right, now we're good. Now we're good. <laughs> Dude, look at that sopping wet field. That is like sopping wet, chat. Guys, can we get a couple hashtags sopping? That is a sopping wet field. Let's do like the edges of the field like a real farmer would. Um, yeah, exactly there, Tobias. Yeah. All right. Let me get the edges because we got to do some edges. Uh, definitely do got to do some edging in this wet field. There we go. Uh, moist. It is very moist. Yeah. This is like the most moistest field I've ever seen in my life. Um, it is sopping. Yes. That is a very moist field. It is. Now, I'm definitely screwing it up a little bit. So... Let's do the edges here, chat. Uh, you sure it doesn't fold out more than that? Yeah, it doesn't fold out any more than that. This is gonna be, this is gonna be an interesting <laughs> journey here. Uh, slippery when wet. Yeah. <laughs> Drunk Holly. Oh my God. Drunk Holly. Drunk Holly's literally like, I'm being good today, and then she drops that comment. I, uh, I don't believe you, Drunk Holly. All right, let's get that down. We don't want to like screw up the edges of the field, guys. So, gotta go round the outside, chat. Round the outside, guys. Round the outside, round the outside, eight hour stream today. Yeah, it might be an eight hour stream today. This could be a very long stream today. Hope you brought snacks, guys. All right, let's get around the outside here. There we go, there we go. All right, sweet. Uh, uh, I am perfectly innocent, says Corey. Corey, that sounds like uh, that sounds like you're covering for something. All right, let me turn on the lights. Gotta hit these lights, chat. I can't see anything. There we go. For some reason it's like kind of dark. Uh, small plow issue. Wait, what? Small plow issue, it's how you use it, says Lee. <laughs> Too bad you can't use your wheel. I don't, apparently there are wheel controls for this. Should I try to use my wheel? I'm using mouse and keyboard, which does kind of suck. Uh, I would rather use a wheel, you're absolutely right. Uh, <laughs> Wayne, what are you saying there, Wayne? All right, now we're gonna go back and forth. Let's go back and forth. We went around the outside. We got it all prepped. Now we're gonna go back and forth here, chat. Back and forth. Do a wheelie. I would love to do a wheelie, but I don't think you can do a wheelie in this game. That wouldn't that wouldn't compute here, chat. Uh, thank you very much there, Bill Hildeman. And what did Mike say? Michael Schwartz says, the pile definitely folds out more. Still has plowing tines on the top. Yeah, it, it, that's that's because it flips. You never saw a plow that works that way there, Michael? So what they what it does is it flips. So what you could do is you could fold it, okay? <clears throat> and then you can flip it. So you could rotate it like this. So that way, it'll, it, like you could just decide which way your wheel goes on, basically. I don't really know why it does that, but it does that, chat. And then you can unfold it. So you got like two different, two different ways to plow. It like flips over, yeah. It flips in each direction. Exactly, yeah. So that's how that works. You, you can't uh, put both down at the same time, unfortunately. At least not for this plow, guys. 
That's rigged. It is rigged, yeah. Oh, I just screwed up my whole plowing operation here, chat. <laughs> All right, let's get let's get some more plowing done. We got to get these rice fields done, chat. This farmer needs it done, guys. It has with it has with the rose to do, says Harry. Chat, does anyone know what Harry's saying? <clears throat> it has with the rose to do. Does anyone know what Harry's saying? I can't understand him today, chat. <laughs> I think he's gotten that margarita mix a little bit early. <clears throat> Passes Baja Blast. <clears throat> no ice to Dan. Hey, boss. What's going on there, boss? How you doing there, buddy? How you doing there, sir? No, let's get this going. I really do like this game, though. It's definitely uh, something different. It is definitely something different. It's very, very cool. Cool scenery, chat, for sure. Harry doesn't know what he... Harry doesn't even know what he's saying. Yeah, I don't think he does. <clears throat> the rose... The rose to do, right? <laughs> Logan, you're not helping. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what Harry's saying, not get more confused, Logan. Has to do with the rose. Oh, has to do with the rose. Okay. He just said it out of order. All right, I got you. Has to do with the rose. So, apparently, the the direction the plow is flipped in has to do with the rose. I got you, Harry V. Okay, now I know what you're saying there, buddy. Now I know what you're saying. Now I'm hungry. Yeah. Now I'm hungry for rice. <laughs> I want rice here. All right, there we go. Look at the, I, I didn't know the, the fields were all wet. How do they get the fields like so wet? Do they like, cause it, what it looks like to me is that these fields are like recessed a little bit. So maybe like the natural rainwater just kind of settles in the rice fields and then they grow the rice under the layer of water. That's kind of what it looks like to me, but I don't know if that's true or not. Um, but it looks like all the fields are kind of like recessed a little bit. Ah, uh, drunk hair, yeah. Uh, we got James, James Giddings with a number one fan. Thank you very much there, James. I can't believe your number one fan sticker doesn't work there, buddy. That is crazy. <laughs> rice, rice, baby. Do, 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 do. Thank you very much there, Mr. Uh, Mr. Sir. I appreciate that, my friend. James Giddings coming in with a 1999 Euro Super Chat there, buddy. Or 999, I'm sorry. Thank you very much for the number one fan. You, sir, are now the number one fan. Uh, press the left shift button. All right. That's cruise control. That's cruise control. That's awesome. Oh, I just killed somebody. I ran into that lady and she turned into a ghost. <laughs> what, what the heck was that about? There was like a thud. <laughs> there was an audible thud. <clears throat> There's definitely some shenanigans going on here, chat. Keeping the fields wet is about how... Yeah, exactly there, Michael. You're absolutely right there, buddy. I, I agree. All right, let's get that going as well. Uh, Logan says, you, <clears throat> you just hit Holly. Chat, why am I so raspy lately? I feel like an old lady who's like, well, every time she talks, she gets all like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Why is that happening? Uh, she's fertilizer now. She is fertilizer. <laughs> she's fertilizer. A, tr a tree will grow in her honor there, Tobias. Uh, drink more fluids. Yeah, I think I need to drink more fluids. Let me drink some fluids here, chat. Quit smoking. <laughs> Quit smoking. <laughs> Chad, I haven't smoked in since I was 27 years old, all right? I haven't smoked. You know what I used to smoke? <clears throat> I used to smoke American Spirits, chat. You remember American Spirits? Chemicals from the wheel taste. It might be, yeah, you're right. It could be chemicals from the, the wheel tasting. You're right. Ah, uh, 13 years ago. Yeah. <clears throat> I quit smoking 13 years ago, chat. That was a long, long time ago, guys. Uh, oh, my God. Wow. Holy guacamole, chat. Why is there multiple musics playing at once? What the heck is happening? Hold on. Let me fix all this. There we go. <laughs> there we go. <clears throat> Night Commander with an amazing, huge super chat. Night Commander. Guys, can we get some Night Commanders in the chat? Wow, that is the biggest super chat of the week, sir. Says, sending happy wet vibes to Uriah uh, as you plow the fields there. Oops, I mean, let us pray. <laughs> Thank you very much, buddy. Oh my goodness, my friend. Thank you for the huge wet vibes. I appreciate that, guys. Thank you so much there, Mr. Night Commander. That is absolutely amazing, sir. You are unbelievable. 
Thank you for the massive, massive super chat, my friend. That really helps out, and I appreciate you, my friend. Yes, I do. Uh, Orville says, I'm okay. That's good there, Orville. Hopefully, you're doing well, buddy. How's your surgery recovery, my friend? Hopefully, you're doing all right. Thank you very much there, Knight Commander, for the massive 50 euro super chat there, sir. And we got Kyle coming with a peach as well. Kyle is looking peachy today, isn't he? You are, buddy. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate that, sir. Uh, it's time to do the helicopter dance. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> no, I don't. Corey, I don't know what you're talking about. What is the helicopter dance? Chat, should I have to do the helicopter dance? He meant to send uh, 50 cents euro. <laughs> yeah, whatever 50 cent euro. Chat, what is a cent in euro? I have no idea what that even is. Uh, what is a euro cent? I don't know what that is. You're right. Uh, thank you so much there, Night Commander. Thank you very much there, Mr. Uh, Mr. Kyle as well for the peach there, buddy. I appreciate that, sir. Thank you very much for the peach. You are very peachy, my friend. And Harry Vanola, thank you for that 50 Swedish kroner, buddy. Appreciate the love there, sir. Says, yes, very good, Raya. If you want the rose to be lapping, uh, <clears throat> or wait, if you want the rose to be leaning to the same side, you turn, oh, oh, Harry. I get it. So you flip the plow depending on which way you want the rows to be leaning. What would be the advantage of leaning a row to one side? What would be the, why would a farmer do that? Does anybody know? Your ascent is us, someone who has not showered. Oh my God. Uh, oh, it's just a Euro cent. Okay. Oh, it's a pence. Okay. A pence. I thought a pence was like the British pound though. Um, like that was like the British pound uh, pence. I thought that's what a pence was. Uh, switch fields. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Maybe for, like, switching fields. You're right. You might be right. Easy access. Yeah, you might be right there, Oliver. Maybe easy access there, buddy. You might be right there, sir. Um. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do the helicopter dance. You ready, chat? You guys want me to do the helicopter live on stream? Uh, you missed the spot. I know I did. I'm going to go back and get it, chat. We'll go back and get it, guys. I don't think we have to have every spot, though, Jesse. Even though it is messing with everybody's OCD. Uh, pretty sure we could just, like, do it how we do it. Uh, but I think we're actually going to pass this challenge, guys. Oh, God, no. Yeah, I'm going to do it, chat. All right, yes? <laughs> All right, here we go. Here's the helicopter dance. Hold on, I'm going to have to unplug my headset for this. All right, you know what? I'm not going to do that because I just got dizzy after one turn. So I'm not going to do that. Ah, uh, sad cowboy. <laughs> no. Hold on. Man down, man down. No, I got dizzy after one turn. <laughs> one turn made me dizzy. What does that mean? Uh, You have to do another field. No, I don't. Oh, do I? Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Our bar's only like a third of the way up. Oh, my God, you're right, Chad. You're absolutely right. So, I Raya and Chad off the work. All right, sounds good, Mark. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, buddy. I think we have a different definition of the helicopter dance chat i know what the helicopter is okay i was doing the helicopter when you guys were little babies all right i was doing the helicopter you know what i used to do <laughs> andrew andrew's andrew knows about the helicopter uh one turn and one <laughs> no 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 i was doing the helicopter chat thank you very much there mr harry b i appreciate it i was just pretending not to know so you guys didn't think i was some kind of weirdo you guys, i wouldn't want i wouldn't want this chat to think i was a weirdo you know if you guys think i'm a weirdo then you might not uh, you might not like the stream, so you know. <laughs> oh, speaking of likes, make sure you tap that like, guys. Get those likes on the board, everybody. Thank you very much for tapping that like. Uh, I did it on a tombstone. <laughs> I, didn't do that. I didn't do the helicopter on a tombstone. <clears throat> Why does Andrew know? Andrew used to hang out with me when I was like when I was like in in like my early twenties. Um, weirdo, but we love you. Oh, thank you, buddy. <clears throat> thank you, buddy. We already know you're a weirdo. <laughs> we already know. Ah, you don't know. You don't know. Uh, I call the shake charmer snake charmer dance. Oh my god. Oh my god. <clears throat> you know, there should be a, you know, you know, the, the helicopter dance shouldn't be <clears throat> just for, for, for men, okay? It should also be for, for other things, okay? I'm here because you are a weirdo. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you. I want to see some other types of helicopters. Uh, we are all weird together. Uh, yeah, it was a party trick. It was a party trick. So what I used to do was every everybody would be happy. So here's what I used to do. Chad, I'll tell you what I used to do. Okay, we would have these parties. And everybody would be having a good time. You know, we'd all be hanging out. 
um, quite literally for me. Uh, we'd all be hanging out, you know, we'd all be talking, having a few drinks, adult beverages, laughing it up, watching movies, you know, just, just having normal, you know, early 20s party stuff. And then I would come downstairs, I would barrel roll into the center of the room, and I would, uh, <clears throat> you know, prepare for takeoff, basically. <laughs> Get those blades warmed up, you know what I'm saying? And then I wouldn't freak out. Uh, so I would ruin it. I ruin the party, yes. I, I am a party ruiner, guys. Yeah. <clears throat> it was kind of my thing. <laughs> hey, Ryan Chad, how is everyone? See, you couldn't do that today. This was before camera phones. So, like, you know, we didn't have cameras on our phones back then. I think today I probably would have been, you know, banished to the nether realm in today's society if I did that. Because, like, everyone would just pulled out their phones and streamed it on TikTok. But you could get away with that stuff back then. It was like it never happened. You know, it was only in your imagination. <laughs> what did Holly say? Oh, God, what did Holly say? Uh, Holly says I prefer... Oh, Jesus, Holly! Can't read that. But, yeah, so, you know, you get away with some stuff back then. All right, let's do this other field here, chat. We only got six minutes. Uh -oh. oh, wait, that's the wrong... Oh, no, that's the right field. All right, we got to do this field, too. Ah, uh, you must scare a lot of people away. I did, yeah, Alfred, but... Here's the thing is, like, back then, everyone was kind of used to it. Like, they knew it was coming. <laughs> I think you had to expect it at one point. Uh, I used to check. I used to. I don't even, I don't know if. I don't even know if I want to say that word, Scott, because I don't know what it means. <laughs> uh, two more fields. Yeah, we got to do two more fields. So we got to do a lot more fields here, chat. We got six minutes on the clock. Uh, we got to do some more fields. Let's do around the edges here, chat. Uh, what's up, Harry? Hope all is good, my friend. What's up there, Mr. James Giddings? Hopefully you're doing well, sir. Thank you very much for that support as well earlier. Um, thank you very much there, Mr. Kyle for the peach. And thank you very much, Harry V as well. Says, yes, very good, Raya. If you want the rose to be... Oh, yeah, I read that. Thank you very much, Harry. You guys are awesome. We're all caught up here, chat. Uh, Raya, hello. What's up there, John Werner? How you doing there, buddy? Good to see you, my friend. Uh, Night Commander, thank you again for that massive super chat there, buddy. You are a stand-up guy, man. Thank you so much for doing that. Appreciate you, buddy. All right, let's go. Let's go. Uh, too busy talking. What do you mean? Uh-oh, what'd I do? Someone's got to pick somewhere. No, they don't, Logan. They better not. <laughs> Logan, Logan, don't you try and get a hold of the old pictures there, buddy. Uh, looking back at the parties as an older man, we were pretty ridiculous. We were, yeah, yeah. We, we used to do some weird stuff, like really weird stuff. I remember this one time. I had a paper bag full of... Oh, wait, I can't tell that story. Never mind. He almost caught it. Yeah, I almost caught it. I don't know what you did, though. I'd have to look a little too far back. <laughs> tell, us, tell us no. 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 Keep talking. <laughs> no. <laughs> paper bag full of candy. No. I had a paper bag full of Bailey's and Girls Gone Wild tapes, chat. Let's just say. That was a good night. Uh, what's up? I made it to the stream. What's going on there, DD Master? How you doing there, buddy? Uh, we used to throw parties and make huge batches of mushroom tea. That's time. Oh, man. Mushroom tea, yeah. Uh, did you see Holly's? Uh, I, I I think I did see Holly's uh, comment earlier. Yeah, <laughs> I did. That's why I freaked out. Uh, have you ever drank Bailey's out of a shoe? I have not yet. Uh, yeah, Bailey's, Bailey's is a good time. Um, you can't start to tell. So, well, there's not really much to tell with that one. I mean... That one's kind of... Uh, I'm trying to think right now if there were any stories that I can tell. And I, I really can't. Like, every story um, that I that I am thinking of right now, I really can't tell. <laughs> uh, remember how ticked off you were when we moved all the furniture out of your room? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So I used to live with Andrew and his brother. I'm still mad about this. I'm still... This is 20... Over 20 years later, and I'm still mad about this chat. So Andrew and his brother, I, I was getting, I was at a wedding that night, okay? I went straight from work to a wedding, okay? And I had a long night. I had a, I had a 10 hour work shift. Then I put eight hours in at a freaking wedding, okay? And all I wanted to do was go home and go to bed. I was so tired. I was so exhausted. All I wanted to do was go home and go to bed, chat. It was five o'clock in the morning. 
Andrew and his brother waited up till 5 a.m. with a video camera so they could tape my reaction. They moved everything out of my room, my computer, my bed, my pillow, my sheets, my Girls Gone Wild tapes, my fake, <clears throat> the other things that I had in that room, my clothing. They took it all and hid it around all, of, all different parts of the house. So I get home, I get up to my room, and all that they left was a pair of my work clothes with a hot dog hanging out of the fly of the pants. So I come home, I turn on my light, and all I see is an outline. It was like a chalk outline of my dead body with a, with a hot dog that's been sitting there for five hours melting into my pants. I was so mad. I was so mad. And I had to go around, and all I see is Andrew's brother with a video camera in my face laughing his butt off at me. <laughs> I was so mad. I was so mad. And they made me go all around the house and find my stuff. My pillow was in the stove. <clears throat> my pillow was in the stove. Uh, my laptop, well, I don't even remember what my laptop was. <laughs> don't worry about that, Tyler. Oh my God, what a disaster. And, they, and I was just so, I was like legit, like so angry. Andrew posted the video. This was actually filmed on videotape. That's how old I am, Chad. Videotape this was filmed on. <laughs> so yeah, they, they played a prank on me, Chad. And I was so tired. They're like, they're like, they actually said, they're like, sorry, I didn't, we didn't realize you were going to get home at five o'clock in the morning. <laughs> we need that video. Uh, I definitely don't have the video. Yeah, Al might have the video. Andrew's brother might have the video. I'll have to see if Andrew's brother has the video, guys. If he does, I'll, I'll show it to you. Um, sure you're buying those MTOs today. He is. <laughs> He's buying the MTOs today, chat. Hot dogs for dinner. <laughs> it's like a hot dog. Just hanging out of this little crotch hole. Oh, my goodness. Um, thank you for the hot... Oh, my God. SSTP's dropping a hot dog super sticker. <laughs> Don't drop any hot dog super stickers today, guys. No. <laughs> no. Hot dogs. I forgot about that. That was a traumatizing event. That's one of the few things I can remember from the days of when I was, like, 19 years old. What's a VHS camera? I think it was like one of those little VHSs. You guys remember those like little tapes? Who remembers little tapes? You had to actually put into like a big VHS tape to like watch it. Uh, it was like a little VHS tape and then you had to plop it into like a VHS tape converter and it would stretch the tape out. Oh my God. That, that was like some ancient technology there, chat. Uh, thank you very much there, SSTP. We got James Giddings coming in with a hot dog super sticker. Please no hot dogs, chat. <laughs> and Harry Vanola. Oh my God, chat. Guys, come on. Hey, chat. Thank you very much, James, for the hot dog super sticker. Thank you very much. <laughs> Stop it. Harry Vanola for the hot dog super sticker. How come Harry's hot dog's so much more expensive than everyone else's? Uh, and Tyler's, too. Tyler's is a $1.49 hot dog. And Holly's is a... Oh, yeah, okay. Never mind. James got the cheap hot dog. Okay. Never mind. James just... James the only one that got the cheap wiener. <laughs> Thank you very much there. James Gettings, Drunk Holly, Tyler. Tyler dropping one. Justin Vanderford... Dropping the hot dog. Oh my goodness, plow faster. All right, let's plow faster. Yeah, we got to plow faster, chat. Oh my God. Yeah, we got to start going back and forth here instead of like side to side here, chat. Thank you so much there, Mr. Uh, Mr. Justin Vanderford, Tyler, uh, Drunk Holly. See what you started, Andrew? <laughs> Look at you started, buddy. Um, we got Justin Vanderford. We got uh, Robert Colvin as well. And Lindsay dropping the hot dogs. Thank you, Robert. <laughs> Thank you, Lindsay. My goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm going to be seeing hot dogs in my sleep tonight, chat because of that tra traumatic event. That's the difference between iPhone and Android. It is, yeah. Super Jesse, you're right there, buddy. Yeah, I think there's a difference there, sir. Thank you so much there, guys. Uh, Quincy the Shredder as well with a 149 hot dog super sticker. Thank you so much, Qu Quincy, as well there, buddy. I appreciate it. Oh, my goodness, Chet. <laughs> we, got, we got Rob H. dropping hot dogs, too. Chris Myers. <laughs> we got Oscar Meyer dropping the wiener. Can I say that? I wish I was an Oscar Mayer wiener. You have two of the three done. Oh, we do. Chat, we have two of the three done. Wait, is that going up? Is that bar going up anymore? Chat, is that bar going up? Switch the other fields. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. All right, where's the other field at? Uh, all right, field three. All right, we got to go to field three. The field three is this way. Okay. 
Ah, uh, you only have to do 60%. Okay, all right. We're, we're going to get... Guys, you think we're going to get this one? You, I think we're actually going to finish a challenge here, chat. This is awesome, guys. Um, Chris Myers, thank you, buddy. Uh, we got Mr. John M coming in with a hot dog super sticker. <laughs> thank you, John. You guys are out of control. Yeah, we will, Marcus. Uh, super Jesse dropping a hot dog. Super Jesse's jumping in on the fun. Thank you, brother. Whoa. Dude, look at those little cherries. Oh, dude, this is beautiful. Wow. The Japan map is absolutely beautiful here, guys. Better stop reading chat. I know. We got to hurry up. We got to hurry up. All right, let's get this last field going. I think it's over here, chat. We'll go get... Oh, crap. There's a fence there. Son of a stink. Uh, pop them chairs. We are Erica. Yeah, we're going to pop them. Oh, no. What? Hey. <laughs> uh, thank you very much there, Super Jesse, again, for the additional hot dog. Super Jesse has two hot dogs, Chad. He's bragging. He's bragging. <laughs> Android. Oh, you got Android? That's interesting. Um, thank you very much, Robert Z, as well. We got Robert Z coming in with the hot dog super sticker also there, buddy. Thank you very much there, Robert Z. Appreciate you, buddy. Uh, we got uh, John M and DJ as well dropping the hot dog. That is the most hot dog. <laughs> Look at this. Jesus Christ. Oh, my goodness. Um, wow. John M, DJ... Robert Z, Super Jesse, and Akira as well. Akira, thank you for the hot dog super sticker there, buddy. First was I iPhone, second was Android. So they're the same. Oh, oh. First was iPhone. So the iPhone ones are cheaper. That's weird. That doesn't even make any sense. Ah, uh, no, I'm on iPhone. Oh, you're on iPhone? So the iPhone ones are cheaper? That is like the first iPhone thing I've ever seen that is cheaper. Ah, uh, cheese and rice. Cheese and rice. <laughs> thank you very much there, Doug Meyer. What's up there, buddy? Uh, Akira and Super Jesse and DJ, thank you for the support, guys. Jeez. <laughs> These oh man, chat. There's other there's other stickers other than hot dogs. I just want to let you know there's other stickers other than hot dogs. <laughs> Quincy, thank you very much there, buddy, for the additional hot dog super sticker, my friend. My goodness, you just take the wheel. I know, right? All right, we're just gonna go back and forth on this one. Let's just go back and forth on this one, chat. I didn't realize that we only needed sixty percent. Actually, why don't we go in a circle? Let's go in a circle. Uh. Karen Rye. <laughs> uh, iPhone got in trouble because they took a bigger cut. They probably pay the same, but Apple is taking their cut. That's true, Marcus. Yeah, you're right, buddy. Maybe Apple got in trouble. Uh, so Ryan's going to get a hot dog and cheese today. No, I am definitely not. I'm not going to be getting any hot dogs for a long time, Chad, after that story. I completely like forgot about that story. <laughs> um, thank you very much there, uh, Harry Vanola, for the peach. All right, we'll take the peach, but don't drop the peach like directly after the hot dog because, you know... That just doesn't look right to me. Um, thank you very much, Harry V. And uh, David Durkin as well with the peach. Thank you, David. <laughs> it's chat. It's chat. <laughs> oh, my God. Amanda dropping a hot dog. David Durkin dropping the peach. Anthony dropping the hot dog. Flight Medic dropping the hot dog. Thank you very much, guys. Josh L. dropping the hot dog. Uh, Quincy's dropping a banana. That's not much better, Quincy, but I'll take it. Thank you for the banana sticker. <laughs> and uh, Robert Z. with a number one fan. Oh, my goodness, buddy. Thank you for the number one fan, my friend. My wife likes bald peaches. Oh, really? Hmm. Good. <laughs> I just had a peach last night. For the first time in a while. I had, I had a peach and I put some cream on it, chat. Has anybody ever creamed their peach? Thank you very much there, Mike Amaki. I put some, uh, like, whipped cream on it. You know, those little spray bottles of whipped cream? It's like, oh, man, it was so good, Chad. Peaches and cream, guys. Thank you very much there, Mr. Akira, for the hot dog super sticker as well. Drunk Holly is dropping the peach. That is a great peach. We got Mike Amaki as well dropping that peach. Thank you for the peach there, Mr. Mike. Appreciate it there, buddy. Robert Z with a massive number one sticker. Thank you so much, Robert. <laughs> Robert's like, I'm breaking this party up. Uh, we also have Mr. Mike Amaki with the additional peach. James Gettings with a peach. Trunk Holly with a peach. Akira with a banana. <laughs> thank you, buddy. Uh, thank you, guys. Uh, Mike Conan with a peach. James Gettings with a peach. Or no, James Gettings with a hot dog. Uh, Adam Wilkin with a hot dog. And Mike Amaki with a hot dog. And Welsh as well with the hot dog. Thank you guys so much. I can't even read them this fast. What are you guys doing? You can't say that on TV. I can't, Robert. Yeah, you're right there, buddy. We all know you crapped your pee. <laughs> Crap myself. Chad, I do. I am. All right. I am a 40 year old man streamer. Okay. I do not crap myself. Uh, thank you very much there, Mr. Michael Maki Welsh as well. James Gettings dropping the flat banana. Why are you dropping the limp banana? I didn't. Why do they have two bananas? They have the limp banana 
and the regular banana. Why is that a thing? Mike Count is dropping the stiff banana. We also have Mr. Tyler as well. Thank you for the hot dog. <laughs> Jeez, oh man. <laughs> You're making me hungry, chat. Uh, Mike Hamaki as well with another hot dog and Knight Commander with a hot dog and Dan Schaub with a hot dog also. Thank you so much. Lindsay as well dropping tractor hot dog peach squirt sweaty face, I think. Uh, don't know where that's going, Lindsay, <laughs> but thank you very much. I appreciate your enthusiasm. Uh, we also have Mr. Anthony as well dropping a burger and uh, whiskey shooter dropping the pie. Stop making me so hungry, chat. You guys are making me so hungry. Uh, give it time, Suzanne. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Uh, what did Drunk Holly say, though? Uh, read Drunk Holly's comment. Uh, has had whipped cream on peaches. Oh, Drunk Holly, what are you saying? What are you saying? We're talking about food, right? Bye, Orville. We'll see you there, Orville. Have a great day, buddy. Hope you're feeling better, sir. What a weird stream this time. <laughs> it's a weird stream. I don't even know how to handle this chat. Um, Night Commander dropping another peach and Anthony dropping the ice cream cone. Thank you, buddy. Give me the ice cream cone, sir. Hurry up, says Dan. Oh, God, we got 43 seconds. We got 43 seconds to go here, chat. Thank you very much there. Mr. Quincy says bananas tend to get... Oh God, Quincy! I can't, I can't read that, buddy. We, I think we've, uh, I think we've crossed some boundaries today. <laughs> uh, why do we always cross boundaries here in the Riot Stream chat? Is that like a, is that like a thing that always happens? I always end up telling a story I really shouldn't have told, and then I have to pay for it for the rest of the stream. <laughs> thank you very much, there, Quincy. I appreciate it, buddy. And Mike Conan, thank you so much for the for the burger there, buddy. At least, at least Mike Conan's like, uh, like actually talking about food, chat. Unless you're referencing something else with that burger. I want to cross, says, uh, says, <laughs> oh my goodness, Kim wants to cross the line. Uh, Denver's laughing at me for some reason. We got Robert Z says, what boundaries? Yeah, well, I mean, I try to set boundaries, and what the chat does is the chat looks at my boundary, they laugh at it, they squirt their little banana at it, and then they throw peaches at me and hot dogs for the rest of the stream. That's what usually happens. Uh, live, laugh, love. Yeah, we just got to live, laugh, love, guys. That's all we got to do. Why is it always dark? They should definitely have these challenges during the day. Nobody's plowing fields at night, chat. <laughs> Ryan isn't going to get the fields uh, to where they need to get. No, I'm definitely not there. <laughs> you think you could contain this chat? Oh, no, Lindsay. I have tried and tried and tried to contain this chat, and the chat does what the chat does. There's no, there's no stopping the chat. You guys are like a hive mind. When you set your mind to something, you will accomplish it. <laughs> like, there's no stopping this chat. Uh, oh, speaking of uh, not stopping, tap that like, chat. Make sure you get those likes on the board. We are at 318 likes on the stream today. Thank you very much, guys. Um, chocolate syrup on the peaches. Yeah. Oh, that actually sounds good. Challenge lost. Bro, what the heck? I plowed all these fields. Oh, my God. This is exactly... This is exactly... This is exactly what the room looked like. How did you get this? How did you make this photo, Logan? That is exactly what the room looked like. I, imagine coming home and your entire bedroom is cleared out and all you see is this on the floor, chat. That was that day. <laughs> that was that day. Um, thank you, Anthony, for the ice cream. Thank you, Mike Conan. And thank you, Night Commander, for the massive 10 euro super chat. Because I'm on the phone with my girlfriend, and all she is is Ryan talking about wieners and limp bananas. Now I'm going to get invite her because I said peaches and cream. <laughs> that is a complicated story, my friend. And I appreciate that. Thank you very, very much. Yeah, that's what it really did look like. All right, we lost that challenge. All right, screw that challenge. Forget Japan. Um, all right. All right, I'm going to try one more challenge here, chat. What happened to the hot dog? Ah, uh, it's not important. <laughs> Uh, McDonald's got a Big Mac, no cheese. Oh, Big Mac sounds delicious. I've been craving a Big Mac. All right, we're going to go do our olive tasting chat. Does anyone want to taste olives with your old pal, Riot? Sunny Sicily is an area famous for its olive groves, as well as beautiful abundant vineyards. Local hotel organized a tasting of the olive for tourists. Because many large-scale stays are planned, the quantities are not so small. Additionally, olives are used to make pizza in the hotel's restaurant. 
Your task is deliver some olives from the groves available in the game area. Be sure to manage it uh, before the first day. Okay, so we got to ship olives to the hotels. All right. Uh, I'm eating Subway right now. Subway. Ooh, that sounds good. Uh, if you're concentrated on the challenges, Raya, you would pass. You only failed the last one of going back and forth so much. I know, David Durkin. I screwed it up, buddy. I screwed it up big time, chat. Oliver. <laughs> All right. All right. Whoa. Whoa, dude. Brah. Brah. Can we just look at this real quick? Dude. Brah. This is beautiful. Look at this. We got sailboats in the background. You know, Farm Sim doesn't have sailboats, chat. Whoa. All right. Now, what our job is, is we have to go and deliver olives to the hotel. So we got to deliver the olives to the hotel no tell here, chat in Italy, guys. He's going to drown. I am there, Lee. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much there, Night Commander, for that massive super chat, buddy. I appreciate it. Thank you guys all for those uh, very delicious super chats, guys. I appreciate it. That is an, uh, should be an illegal amount of hot dogs. All right, so what we're going to do is we got to deliver to the hotel. So let's go over to the hotel. Third time, get get her done. All right, the third time's a charm. We failed the first two um, challenges. Now, who thinks we're going we're gonna to do good on these challenges? I think we're going to do good on these ones, guys. So we got Olive Grove number two, Olive Grove number one. Uh, okay, it looks like there's three Olive Groves. So let's go with the biggest Olive Grove first, I guess. We'll go with that one first there, guys. And uh, we'll try and deliver uh, to the hotel no tell chat. Now, I don't know if there's, like, a trailer or anything we can use, but I hope we don't have to, like... Is there, like, a trailer? Where's the trailer at? Um, usually, this stuff is blue that we own. All right, let me go. Let me get out of this view. And what we'll do is we'll look in our... Yeah, oh, man. All we have is this. Oh, dear. That's not good, chat. One for three. We're, we're zero for two right now. Uh, don't do it if you... Stick to the minimum. You'll do it if you stick to the minimum. Okay. All right, let's stick to the minimum. You're right. Uh, Night Commander, thank you very much there, buddy. Ooh, look at this thing here, Chad. This thing's pretty sweet. Turn on that beacon. Turn on those lights. Okay, there we go. Very good, Chad. Very good. All right, let's go deliver these olives. Uh, that doesn't look like deer. No. So I guess we got to pick the olives with this thing. Dude, this map is freaking epic right here. Crap, my sub expired. Sorry, Ryan. Oh, don't worry about that, Brian Falls. You take care of yourself there, buddy. And, uh, you know, don't worry about your old pal, Ryan. Uh, no trailer and you fill it up and drop it off. Oh, you just got to fill it up and drop it off, Jonesy. Okay there, buddy. Thank you very much there, buddy. All right, let's get a couple hashtag fill it up, Ryan. We're going to fill it up, okay? Um, oh, wait. I thought you were doing grapes. I feel stupid. No, we're doing olives. Uh, maybe I did say grapes, though, Lindsay. I, I don't know. <laughs> Hurry up already. I need my wine. <laughs> You don't make wine from olives. Ooh, olive wine? Is that like a thing? Does olive wine exist? Ooh. That does sound kind of gross. Olive fields. Olive fields of Raya. I'm sure it does. Yeah, everything pretty much exists, chat. So, you know, you got to take the bad with the good. All right, so here we go. Let's get these olives filled up. So we're going to turn this into work mode. Ooh. <laughs> Why is it shaking like that, chat? Whoa. All right. Get it going. Uh oh. Oh, this is cool. This is cool. Look at this. This is crazy. <laughs> wow. Congrats, George. Uh, because of you, Raya, I finished my CDL school and all that's left is the actual CDL test. Oh my goodness. Are you serious, George? Guys, can we get some congrats to George? He just finished his CDL school. And all that's left is the test. Oh, good luck. Good luck there, buddy. Oh, dude, look at the olives pouring out. That is so cool. Dude, best of luck to you, my friend. I hope everything goes well. I'm sure it will. Uh, you sound like you know what you're doing already there, buddy. So thank you very, very much for, uh, for, for saying that, my friend. And I wish you the best of luck, my friend. Yeah, congrats, George. That is so cool, man. You're going to get your CDL. 
Look at my back flap. Why is my back flapping? <laughs> Chat, why is my back flap hanging open? All right, there we go. Oh, this is so awesome. I actually kind of like doing this. This is satisfying right here. Uh, hi, James. What's going on there, James? Thank you very much there, Mr. Uh, that is so cool there, uh, Mr. Sir. Uh, Ryan, are all fruits or vegetables? Okay. Do I look like a man who doesn't know if olives are a fruit or a vegetable? Wait, no. Olives are a fruit. They're a fruit. He's Googling. No, I knew that. I just had a notification on my phone. <laughs> uh, what you looking up? Oh, nothing. I was looking up um, something unrelated to that question. Yeah, that's all. Don't worry about that. Uh, keep moving, fail. Oh, yeah, we're going to fail. Yeah, we got to keep moving. Uh, seeds are on the inside. Yeah, the seeds are on the inside. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you staring at your crotch? I was looking at my phone. I had a very important notification at the exact same time that somebody asked that question. So it was just a weird coincidence, chat. Uh, thank you very much there, Oliver, for... What is that? Is that an is that an olive emoji? I didn't even know they had olive emojis. Thank you very much, Oliver, for the olive emoji. Oliver dropping an olive. Thank you, buddy. It's pulsing. It is very pulsy. <laughs> Why is it so pulsy, chat? Uh, it's quinky ding. Yeah. Dude, look at my sides filling up with these olives. That is pretty cool. That's pretty awesome, actually. I kind of like this. So we got to we gotta get all these olives to the hotel no tail chat. That's what we got to do. Uh, imagine that, Sister Bias. I know, right? <laughs> Thank you very much there, Oliver and Night Commander as well. Tobias! Tobias! Tobias, don't be, be, don't be, don't be a Tobias. Fruits have seeds, veggies don't. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Fruits have seeds, veggies do not. Well, how do you plant vegetables without seeds then? Like, don't carrots have seeds and things? Or like, how do you like plant vegetables? Now, here's a question. Is a potato a fruit or a vegetable? That is a question. Does anybody know what a potato is? Now, potato is a weird crop. Um, I'll do my best. All right, sounds good to us. <laughs> Does anyone know what a potato is? Dang it. Carrots grow seeds from their stems. Oh, really, Tobias? Okay. They grow seeds from their stems. It's a fruit. Uh, isn't it a root, though? I thought a potato was, like, neither a fruit or a vegetable. It's a root crop. Like, a root like kind of like a beetroot is uh it's a root vegetable okay so it's technically a vegetable so so a potato is technically a vegetable okay uh potato is a streamer <laughs> it's a streamer chad i am not a potato uh the potato is a youtuber true fact <laughs> stop it Corey. Corey, just because you say true facts it doesn't mean it's a true fact buddy okay i am not a potato um a tuber that's it <laughs> um carrots are not vegetables so so if carrots have seeds by your definition, that makes them not a vegetable? Really? And peanuts are not nuts. Well, what are peanuts then? What are, what are peanuts, chat? Uh, can anyone tell me what peanuts are then? Potato is a streamer from PA. <laughs> uh, correction, a potato is a bald streamer. Rye is a van owner. I am a van owner. That is a true fact. You're right. Uh, but that has nothing to do with what we're talking about. Carrot Top is a guy. That's a fact. Well, that's possible, yeah. Uh, the potato is a starchy root vegetable native of the Americas. Okay, so it isn't technically a vegetable then. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Chat, look at that quivering motion. That's kind of like a... I, I kind of like that. So it, so basically what this machine is doing is it's just like shaking and jimmying and, and jerking the vines or jerking the plants a little bit to get all the olives to fall out. Is that what's happening here? And if that is what's happening here, doesn't that mean that you would get like, le like leaves and other debris in your machine as well? Like how does it separate the olives from the debris chat, the debris. Uh, farm sim. It's not farm sim chat. We're not playing farm sim. <laughs> uh, it's a machine massager. Oh, it's a massager. Okay, it's a massager. And it massages the, uh, or massages 
the plants to make them uh, more relaxed so they fall. That makes sense. Uh, he must have frozen for you. Hell must have frozen over for you to play farm sim. I'm not playing. This isn't farm sim. This is called Pure Farming 2018. It is not farming giant software farming simulator. This game is superior in almost no ways, but a few ways. <laughs> uh, popcorn is a vegetable. Oh yeah, popcorn's a vegetable, you're right. Popcorn comes from corn that is popped. You learned something today. Corn, popcorn comes from corn. Bet you didn't know that. Expect, uh, doesn't have an auto save. Yeah, it doesn't have an auto save though, so you gotta like start over. <laughs> or remember to save it. Uh, we got uh, Quincy the Shredder coming in with a two dollar super chat. Thank you, Quincy. Says carrots are also a root vegetable. It is, but like, how do you grow carrots? Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant chat. Uh, I knew that a long time ago. You didn't know that, Corey. Uh, Lee says popcorn comes from Walmart. That's true. Popcorn comes from Walmart. All right, we're all filled up, chat. Guys, what do I do if my um if my thingy's filled up? What do I do? All right, let me turn off my back flapper. And then let's go over here and dump. We got to dump at the uh, at the hotel. We need fresh olives from the hotel, chat. Uh, stick it in the ground. Yeah. All right. Whoa. Look at this. Look at this like map. It's like all, all hilly and stuff. It's kind of cool right here, chat. All right. There's the hotel no tell. So we're gonna dump the olives in front of the hotel no tell, I guess. So we gotta back it up, chat. Let's back it up, guys. We gotta back it up. This is kind of cool. I like this, chat. There right, we go. Yeah, drop them. Bro! Bro! Look at that! Dude, there's somebody with a van! They have vans in Italy! Vans in Italy confirmed, chat. Vans in Italy confirmed. Uh, you know what movie I watched last night? Chat, does anyone, has everyone, in, bleh, has anyone ever seen the movie Inglorious Bastards? Has anyone ever seen that movie, chat? That movie, I've been seeing like a lot of like clips of that on YouTube and I, it made me rent the movie last night. Now, luckily, I spent an obscene of money on Amazon recently, so I got a free movie credit from them, which is pretty cool. But uh, that movie is amazing. Yeah, six times, yeah. Yeah, that movie is unbelievable. Uh, it is so good. And I found out during that movie that Italy was one of the bad guys. Did you know that Italy was on the bad people's side? Everyone always looks at Italy as like this nice country. They were on the side of the Axis. Can you believe that? That's crazy. Uh, yeah, on the, uh, yeah. That's wild. Um, Sheesh, I have spent a lot of movie uh, with Amazon and never gotten a movie. Really? Uh, how much exactly needs to be spent? So to rent a movie on Amazon, it's usually anywhere between three and four dollars to rent a movie, buddy. So all you gotta do is download Amazon app on your TV or wherever you wanna watch it, your phone or whatever. And uh, you can just hook up your Amazon account and rent movies there, buddy. It's like three bucks a pop. Uh, Evil Italy, yeah, Evil Italy. Um, Learned that in junior high school, Bozo. <laughs> I probably did too, but I just forgot about it. Oh wait, we already did all these. We gotta get the ones with the olives. Where's the olives? I can't like see which ones have olives and which ones don't. Let me get out here, chat. Uh, all right, did they, does this one have olives? No. Does this one have olives? Yes, there's the little olives. Okay, so that's the one we have to go to. Uh, keep moving, slacker. All right, we got to keep moving. Uh, what movie? It's called Inglorious Bastards. It's a movie about um, this group of uh, American soldiers that goes through... They're like American special ops soldiers or like secret agents or whatever they are. And they go through uh, uh, occupied France to uh, kill Nazis, basically. It's an amazing movie, chat. It is unbelievable. All right, let me get uh, let me get vibrating here, chat. There we go. Uh, it's got Brad Pitt, you know, sexy Brad Pitt, the guy with the bat. Oh, I know, yeah, yeah, the bear or whatever they called him. He was unbelievable. Oh, am I doing the wrong ones again? Ah, oh, crap. Uh, Fury is a good one too. What's what's Fury about there, Marcus? What's Fury about? Everyone everyone keeps mentioning Fury. What is Fury about too? Uh, secret tunnel turned secret agents. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. It was it was definitely a great movie. Uh, tanks. Oh, it's about tanks? Okay. So, Fury's about tanks. World War II tanks. Alright, I might have to look into that movie, too. I'm not, like, a big, like, I'm not, like, big on World War II movies, but a lot, I mean, most of them are extremely good. Like, the, the movie, the, you know, a lot of those, like, Saving Ryan's Privates or 
I think I might have said that one wrong. Uh, the ones about the beaches in Normandy. Cars is a great movie, too. I don't like Cars. I don't like Cars. Cars makes me cringe. <laughs> Are you talking about the Cars like the kids movie? I don't like that movie, Tyler. <laughs> the Cars. <laughs> you should make that movie. I'm not going to make a movie chat, no. I think that's the... Steve! Uh, Saving Ryan's Privates. Oh, no, that's not a movie about me, Chad. No. <laughs> Saving what now? <laughs> yeah. Cars is good. I don't like cars. I know cars is good. Are you not American, says Adam. I am American, yeah. I just don't like, I just don't like, like, I don't know. I don't like, for some reason, for some reason, chat, it's the same thing with, like, video games. I have to have a certain level of graphics. Like, I know there's, like, a lot of good games out there that I write off because they look cartoony. So, like, a lot of, like, cartoony stuff that, like, has that, like, Disney look to it, I just can't get into. Probably has to do with a Mickey Mouse incident I had in the third grade. I'm not going to tell you about it, but that might be why I don't like Disney-type stuff. Um, it could stem back to the third grade bus. Uh, but I just don't know. Don't tell him mom, babysitter's dead. <laughs> yeah, but those, like, those, like, types of movies I just can't, I, for some reason I just can't get into. I don't know why. Um, I might have been scarred for life back in the day. Um, thank you very much there, Night Commander. Uh, thank you so much there, Mr. Harry Vanola. We got Harry B coming in with a 50 Swedish kroner. Says, I recommend a movie with Tom Hanks called Greyhound. I freaking love Tom Hanks. Deborah needs muted. Does she really there, Frank? Uh, what, what's Deborah say? I don't like Star Wars. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, you offended Frank by saying that. I do like Star Wars. I, I used to not could like one to like that or wait was that even a sentence <laughs> i used to not want to like star wars because everybody liked it <laughs> tom hanks lost the translation an awesome movie yeah what is that movie harry greyhound it's about chasing german submarines all right i'm gonna have to look that up there harry send me a message on that one buddy i'll forget as soon as in like five minutes uh what are you saying i don't know what now? i don't know what i'm saying i don't know what i'm saying no, it was a movie called, uh, yeah, all the Star Wars. I, I, I didn't want to like them. But then I sat down and I actually watched them. And, like, you know, I, because, like, I'm always, like, that type of person who's like, oh, well, everybody likes it, so it has to suck. You know, like, anything pop, most popular stuff, like popular music, all sucks. Anything you hear on the radio is terrible. Um, you know, most popular pe movies uh, suck, things like that. So, like, I'm always, like, team, like, no popular. Well, that is a popular movie that is actually good. I, I love Star Wars, guys. Like, the, the whole story, the, 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 the pacing of those movies, if you actually look at them as not, like, the novelty and you actually look at them like a movie. Hipster, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm like a hipster. <laughs> well, I'm not a hipster, though. I don't like hipsters either because it's cool to be a hipster. So, I don't like not liking things just because it's cool to not like them either. So... I'm not a hipster. Okay, do you understand what I'm saying, chat? <laughs> Rise a hipster. I'm not a hipster. I don't like Star Wars either. Really, Robert? I, I don't know. See, I do. I actually do. That is one popular thing that I think is actually good. I really enjoyed those movies. Now, I don't remember any of them. I don't know the lore of them. Um, I, I just, like, watch them as, like, oh, it's an action movie. Like, I don't really care about the characters or the lore of it. I just watch it. That's one of those movies I can just brainlessly watch. Um, just like we're brainlessly picking olives here. Um, I love the original trilogy. Disney jacked it up. Uh, did they really, Steve? They jacked it up. Ah, that's unfortunate, man. Yeah, I haven't really watched a lot of the new ones. I did watch all nine of them. I watched the, like, nine original ones. Now, I don't really know anything about any of the side stuff. Like, I watched the, the first three. Then they made the... They, so, the way Star Wars works is the original three movies were actually chapter four, five, and six of, of the story. So the main story was a nine chapter story. Um, the first movie is chapter four. The second movie is chapter five and the third movie is chapter six. Oh yeah, keep rolling. Oh yeah, we gotta keep rolling. And then, then they made one, two, and three. Then they made uh, seven, eight, nine. That's how it is. Yeah, there's nine of them. There's nine of them. And I liked pretty much all of those. I thought all of those were pretty good. Um, some are better than others, of course. Uh, thank you very much there, Oliver and Quincy and Harry V as well, man, for that uh, suggestion there, sir, and that super chat. 
Uh, hi, Harry. Best movie ever is Waterboy. <laughs> Water, Waterboy is a great movie. Uh, the TV shows I've seen have been decent. Yeah, see, I, don't, I can't get into, like, the TV shows and stuff. Um, you know what TV show I did recently watch that I thought was really good? And let me know what anybody thought of this. There's a show on Netflix. Now, it's a, it's a European show. I know, but it's still good. Called... Well, I don't remember what it was called, but it was about... Well, I don't remember what it was about either, but it was good. Uh, Team Logan. What am I talking about, chat? There's a new show on Netflix. Oh, it's called Fool Me Once. Yeah, no, it's not Doctor Who, no. <laughs> it's called Fool Me Once. It must be really good. <laughs> yeah, no. It's called Fool Me Once. So let me just tell you about the beginning of Fool Me Once. Um, I watched the whole and I binged it uh, last this week, I think, or over the weekend. Um, what is the Mickey Mouse story? So I'm not telling that again, buddy. I can't be telling that Mickey Mouse story again, buddy. I've already told it twice in its full detail. Uh, anyone here ever seen Knives Out? And Knives Out? No, I never saw that. Um, but let me tell you what Fool Me Once is about. Fool Me Once about this girl, okay? And she... Her husband gets killed in a mugging robbery, okay, at the beginning of the movie. So, like, this girl is, is, is like, you know, she's very distraught. They, it starts out with, like, her husband's funeral. And her husband gets killed by these, like, muggers in, in this park, okay? I'm not going to ruin it. No, I'm not ruining anything. This is all in the previews. I'm not ruining anything. Trust me. I'm not ruining it by telling you this. This is, like, literally, like, the first, very first part of the show. Um, and it's in the previews. It's not, this is not, not ruining anything, chat. So, the girl finds out, you know, the girl finds that, or, you know, or, or, no, her husband gets killed. And then, um, after the funeral, her, her friend gives her this, uh, what do they call those cameras that are, like, in things? So you can, like, spy on nannies. What do they call, like, nanny cameras? You know what I'm saying? Um, she gives her this camera so that she can, like, spy on, uh, or so she can spy on her nanny or whatever for her kid. It's like a gift. Uh, nanny cam. Yeah, nanny cam. <laughs> yeah, a nanny cam. You're terrible at describing things. I am. I'm so bad at, like, describing things. So, so her friend gives her this nanny cam. Well, a few days goes by. She finds the nanny cam. Or she, she opens up the nanny cam. She looks at the video. She looks at the video. And her freaking husband comes in to the nanny cam, holds her daughter, and, like, hugs her daughter, looks directly at the camera, and then walks out of the room. Her dead husband, who she watched get murdered. Oh! And then it goes on, like, it's like a nine-episode story. I'm not going to tell you anymore. I'm not going to spoil anything, but that's, like, the premise of the show. Oh, man. That hooked me. That hooked me. Have you finished the show? I finished the whole show. Yeah, Deborah. I, I watched the entire show from front to back. Uh, what's the name of that movie? It's a show on Netflix called um, uh, Fool Me Once. It's called Fool Me Once. I'm watching this. It's crazy. Yeah, but it's like a European show. So if you don't like European-style things, um, it's really not, like, you know, focused on that or anything. But, you know, just be aware that it is a European-style show. Um, but it, it's good. It's very, very good, chat. Uh, it's a British show. Yeah, it's a British show. It's it's amazing, though. It is an absolutely amazing show. Uh, thanks, Ryan, for letting me know. My husband is dead. Just kidding. <laughs> watch it. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, no spoilers, guys. But it is, it is pretty wild. Even the ending is good. So the ending, basically what happens at the end. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not going to spoil the end. I was going to spoil the end, chat. No, I'm just kidding. I would never do that. <laughs> I would never spoil the end. Why is this thing turning on now? Uh-oh. Turn on. All right, we are flapping and vibrating now. Wait, no. Wait. It, oh, crap. Flap and vibrate. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I wasn't going to spoil it. I wasn't going to spoil it. Hey. Spoil it, says Oliver. I'm not going to spoil it. Chat, do I look like a son of a stink streamer that would spoil the ending of a show just after I told you to watch it? No. No. Uh, is it full? No, it's not full. We literally just dumped it. We just took our dump, guys. Uh, slap and tickle. We'll give it a good slap and tickle. Chat, how much, uh, how much time do I have? Uh, why is it saying 0%? We're supposed to deliver to more than one hotel. 
Oh my god. Chat. New drop off location. Okay. Oh, we might have wasted all of us. You have to go to the second hotel now. Yeah. You finished the first part. Okay. <laughs> all right. We got to go to Casa de Olive. How original. <laughs> reduce time to one time. I can't. It won't let me reduce time. It won't let me reduce time. You can't reduce time in these. These are, these are, yeah, time for the next objective. Okay. All right. So now we got to deliver all of the Casa de Olive. Okay. Uh, you have got to start paying attention. <laughs> I got it. Dude, we have to get at least one. We have to get, we have to get at least one challenge done, chat. Am I allowed to end the stream before I get a challenge done? Uh, want to go to break some bottles behind Wawa, maybe dig a hole. I would love to, Ledgefish. Now that's freedom, buddy. That's freedom. You ever break bottles behind Wawa and then dig a hole, burn some wood? Now that's freedom, guys. Uh, Dan said it 10 minutes ago. Yeah. Um, Frank Mason says no. Uh, nope, denied. All right, all right. All right, fair enough, chat. So we have to get this done. We have to finish this uh, challenge here, chat. We have to. It is in the bylaws. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, we're going to we're gonna dig some holes and burn some wood. Uh, read Orlando's comment. Orlando said read Tyler's comment. Tyler said read Holly's comment. Holly said read Dan's comment. Dan didn't make a comment. Oh, Dan said, what's the next objective? I think you met the minimum requirements for this one. Oh my God, Dan tried to tell me so long ago. He tried to tell me so long ago. Read Deborah's comment. Deborah says, read Dan's comment. Dan says, 57 likes away from 400. Guys, tap that like. <laughs> tap that like. Read Raya's comment. Read Raya's comment. Yeah, is this like comment inception here? Is this like a comment within a comment within a comment within a comment? And then time slows down at like the final comment? <laughs> read Logan's comment. All right, read Logan's comment. Uh, where's Logan's comment? What are you showing pictures of, Spicy Steve? Spicy Steve? Oh, wow. Spicy Steve has a basement full of Star Wars memorabilia. That is wild. Uh, read Jonesy's comment. All right, let me read Jonesy's comment. Read Logan's comment. Stop telling me to read. Read Robert's comment. Stop telling me to read others' comments. <laughs> All right, we got this field done, chat. Oh, we should have done this. these fields first. I really fucked this up. Read Drew's private diary. I will. I'm going to read Drew's diary. March 15th, 2002 or something. We left a hot dog in Raya's pants on his floor and took all the stuff out of his room to play a prank on him. Uh, you need to send the olives to the other place. Yeah, yeah, I will, I will. But we got to pick up these olives, too. Let's go pick up these olives, chat. Right, let me just shut this down so we can go faster. But we got to go over here and get these other olives, chat. Uh, let's go do that, guys. Who's that walking? Don't be walking. Wait a second. Where are they going right now? Okay, yeah, we got to go this way. Uh, did you like The Abyss, Raya? Oh, yeah, the movie The Abyss? Oh my God, yeah. That was a terrifying movie. I, I really don't like movies. I get very uncomfortable with movies where there's like drowning. And The Abyss was like, it was like people drowning for like three hours. <laughs> so yeah, that, that movie that movie was very tense. Those types of scenes get me very tense, chat. Uh, read Lauren's comment. What did Lauren say? She didn't, she didn't make no comment. <laughs> uh, read The Abyss's comment. <laughs> the Abyss's comment. Read the abysses. Oh, is the abyss somebody? I thought you were talking about the movie, The Abyss. That's an old movie. Is there actually someone named The Abyss in this chat? Uh, Duquesne University just pulled a massive tournament upset. I, I couldn't care less, chat. I, I don't care about basketball, buddy. I'm sorry, man. I know you're super into it, but I, but I, I really don't care what, what anybody's doing in basketball, buddy. I'm sorry. Um, it is weird. It is weird, yeah. Yeah, I'm just not into basketball, chat. I mean, I know there's a tournament going on right now, but, you know, I, I can care less. Uh, read Knight Commander's comment. All right, what's Knight Commander's comment? Uh, Knight Commander says, read the Abyss's comment. I already read that. No way, Chad. No way, Chad, says Kyle. <laughs> um, I like the movie about Raya. It's called 40-Year-Old Virgin. Chad, that's not about me, Brad. Brad Stahl! The 40-Year-Old Virgin. First of all, 
We've all heard the graveyard story, okay? Read Rise comment. Raya is more of a tennis guy. Yeah, don't don't come in here dropping sports facts. I, this is a live stream. We're farming. Okay. Why would you come in here and drop sports facts, man? Like, come on, it has nothing to do with this. <laughs> oh, I do appreciate your enthusiasm, though. At least you're into something. At least you care about something. That makes me happy. That's good. That's a good thing. Um, thank you very, very much there, Mr. Uh, SSTP says, since you're already distracted, will you be playing the new gas station sim DLC? No, uh, you can have a gas station on the beach. I know, I, I <laughs> all right. So let me go on a little bit of a spiel about gas station sim, okay? As sta er, ga <laughs> Dang it, I can't even say it without getting upset. <laughs> right story. What are you talking about, Super Jesse? Super Jesse, why are you such a negative Nancy so much lately there, sir? I don't live in my basement and yeah, my stream failed, but it was successful once, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, uh, thank you very much, SSTP. So Gas Station uh, Simulator really burned us on the last few DLCs. The last few DLCs for Gas Station Simulator were absolutely terrible. They ruined the game. Not only did they, not only were they terrible DLCs, they also ruined the main game too. So it completely turned me off from Gas Station Sim. I swore that I would never play that again. Now what they did was they delete, they or no, they released a a new DLC that basically uh, you open a gas station on like a tropical island type type uh, like a beach type. Thing, but it's the same game with different scenery. I don't think there's anything different with the game. I was watching uh, some streams of it, and it was literally the same thing as Gas Station Sim, just redone as a beach. <laughs> like, why would you play that? All they did was change the scenery and re-release another DLC. Play it tomorrow. We might play it tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna have to look more into it. That was Pumping Sim. Oh yeah, Pumping Sim was a different game. You're thinking of Pumping Sim. So Pumping Sim, that was an indie game. Gas Station Sim was what we played a long time ago. Oh, that sucks. Now, I'm not saying it is like that. What's wrong with that? Uh, well, I mean, if you wanna do the same thing over and over and over, Olive, I mean, be my guest there, buddy. But yeah, I, don't, I have no interest in that. Um, that'd be like if we played a game where I just plowed the same Olive Field over and over and over again. Like, nobody wants to see that. All right, let's get these olives over to this uh, hotel. Um, it gets redundant. Exactly, it gets redundant. I've, I've streamed Gas Station Sim a thousand times. Like, I've streamed that game a million times. I've played it a million times. Like, if they're not going to bring anything new to the table, then, you know, I'm sorry. I'm out. <laughs> uh, how did you go fast there? Well, I, it, it, we're filled up right now. So, uh, when you're filled up, um, I guess you get magic powers to go faster. <laughs> wow, such a golly. I'm sorry, Ollie. I want to see it. It's like farming sim. Yeah, so, well, all right, man. All right, let's look at the preview video. Let's just look at the preview video chat. Let me see if they show anything new in the preview video. If they show any new gameplay in the preview video, I'll stream it, buddy. How about that? We'll make a deal. Uh, let's make a deal. There, guys. All right, gas station simulator. Tidal wave DLC, $12, too. $12, too. Okay. Oh, this isn't even gameplay. So they're showing not gameplay. Oh, it's a boat warehouse. Huh. Oh, the same painting. Oh, that horrible painting. Remember the painting? What is this? That's the same. Yeah, that's the same. Boat gas. Oh, God. Pick up garbage? Oh. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh, giant shark. Ice cream, that's the same. That's the same. Eh. I don't know. The only thing I saw was boat gas. That was the only thing I saw. Boat gas. 
And uh, yeah, everything else was the same. I I'm gonna pass on that. That looks that looks terrible, to be honest. <laughs> I don't have any interest in that, guys. Sorry. Yeah, garbage pickup, the same painting, the same pumping. They do have boats, though. That that's kind of cool. I will admit that they have boats, though. Uh, I will admit that they have boats, though. What kind? What kind of like? Um, you can't stream tomorrow. You have plans of your van. No, 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 no. I I do have a wedding to go to tomorrow, Jesse. I don't know. That's not till like four or something though. But I don't know if I'm gonna stream tomorrow or not yet. I haven't figured that out yet, guys. Um, thank you very much, SSTP. I appreciate that, buddy. Satori distracted. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate that comment. And we also have Tyler Cheatham as well with the five dollars super chat. Thank you, Tyler. Appreciate that, buddy. Tyler Cheatham. The tow truck game. Out of pack stand releases. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Let's bitch. The tow truck game out of Pakistan. Chat, did I ever tell you that story? I think I did. I, I tried to pay a developer to make my own tow truck game. I tried to pay him. They advertised on Fiverr. Uh, they will make a video game for you. Uh, they will make a video game for you. Where do I drop these off at? For $1,000. I tried to do that. I tried to pay them. Read Kyle's comment. Uh, what was Kyle's comment? Um, let's see here. Kyle said I would rather play Ranch with Kyle. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, I would rather play Ranch with Kyle, to be honest with you. All right, let me back it up here, chat. We're going to back it up. We're going to go into this place. Back it up, chat. We're going to back it up. Let's sell them. Or sell. Why are we selling? Olive Factory. We met the minimum requirements, chat. Oh wait, it still says we have to do more though. Does that count? But it still says we have to do more. Should we try to meet the maximum requirements? Let's try to meet the maximum requirements. Whoa, there's a freaking volcano here. What is this? <laughs> Hold on, let's go up this mountain real quick. <laughs> let's see what's going on up there. Let's go up on there. Ah, uh, that's a pass. All right. Sounds good. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on top of this mountain? Go max. Hold, hold on a second. Is there a way to turn on the flat? Is there like a flashlight? Yeah, there is. Wait, why won't it let me go this way? Oh, come on. No. Uh, you can do more, but minimum is just as good. Yeah. Oh, dang it. It won't let me go up there. Uh, drone. Oh, drone. Yeah, drone. Let's see if we can do the drone over there. Let's open up the tablet. Can we drone over there? Drone starting. Yeah. I didn't even think about the drone. That's a good idea, Tyler. Night vision. All right. There's night vision. Oh, wait. Where's the... Oh, the drone starts at the farm. Okay. Drone starts at the farm. They knew you would try and dive into it. I know. Uh, all right. How do I raise altitude? Uh, oh, wait. Now we're at the beach. Okay. There's the beach. Um, let me try and find this here, chat. It won't let me, like, look up anymore. Insufficient funds. Insufficient funds for what? <laughs> uh, let's see here. Uh, I'll play Rancid with you. We can stream it in Discord or I has to watch it. All right. That's not... I would, I would be down with that, Jesse. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds a lot, a lot better than me having to play it. Oh, where, oh, let me look at the map. I can't look at the map, so like... Oh, mini-map zoom. Okay, page down. Okay. All right, no. All right, let me, let me try to find... Uh, $5 says he crashed the mountain. No, 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 no. North. I think it was actually north. Was it north? There is a mountain here, but... Yeah, it was this way. It was this way for sure. Uh, we need to harvest more olives. No, no, we're, we're done. We finished the, uh, the challenge. So what I'm trying to do now is I'm trying to get up into the volcano. I want to I wanna see this volcano chat. That would be pretty cool. Um, thank you very much there, Tyler Chief. It says, Farmer Raya harvested any potatoes lately. Thank you for the five bomb there, buddy. Appreciate you. Okay, it's right here. Let's see if we can go up there. Ah, it's too high. Dang it. 
Why can't I go up any higher? It won't let me go. In, it won't let me go high enough to get into that volcano. They really locked this volcano out. That is some nonsense. Yeah, I'm trying to get it in the volcano. It won't. Bummer. Yeah, it looks like the COD gunship. It does. <laughs> yeah, I can't get up there, chat. You stinking game. Yeah, it won't even let me look up farther. What are they hiding up there? What are they hiding up there? All right, let's turn off the drone, guys. There we go. Uh, drone land. Yeah, they won't even let me go up there. That is so dumb. Uh, that would be so cool. Uh, you just, like, jump in the volcano. That'd be awesome. That'd be a good way to get rid of your equipment that you don't want to use anymore. <laughs> Um, let's save the game. All right, let's save the game, chat. We're going to save the game. All right, uh, let's go back to the menu. There is no save. Why is there no save? Demand a refund of your $2. That's outrageous. It is, Lindsay. It is. It's kind of, it's kind of outrageous. Egregious, even. <laughs> um, all right, so let's take a look. I paid like $20 for this game. Let me see if they unlock the challenges. Okay, so we did do that. Yes, we can now do young wine, chat. Let's get a couple hashtag young wine. Although I don't really want to do that at all. So I'm not going to do that. You know what? They have a work. Sh what is all this importing stuff? They got mods. The wolf pack. Uh, I paid $9, but I just got all the DLC. That's pretty cool, Akira. Yeah, this game's fun, man. We were just doing like the challenges. I failed all of them. Um, the only one I did was Italy, and Italy was like the easiest and lamest one. I was hoping to do the Colombian one because the Colombian one actually has exciting stuff. Look what the Colombian one says it has jungle fire, it has exotic mechanic, uh, it has rainy season. Coffee beans and unknown disease. So like those are all the fun ones in Colombia. All the other ones are kind of lame. <laughs> jungle fire. We we tried jungle fire. I failed it. Remember? Uh, should I should I try jungle fire again and try to win it? Should I should I try jungle fire and actually win it? Like because we we I kind of screwed up on the last one. I just sat there for a while. Try it again. All right. It was a short one. It was a shorty. Let's get a couple of hashtag Raya shorty. All right, let, let, let's give it a shot. Well, let's get a little, 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 You know what I'm saying, chat? All right, we're going to give it a shot. We'll give it a shot, guys. Let's get some coffee cups in the chat. Yeah, Ringo, it is the title of the, of the stream today. So I feel like I should at least win the one that I did the title of the stream, you know? Uh, and I believe we have to use this thing right here. Uh, hashtag ride shorty. Yeah, exactly. So let's go. Let's go get the hemp first. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do a speed run of this here, chat. Let's do it, guys. Here we go. Hurry up, hook it up. There we go. We got a quick hook up. I love a good quick hook up, chat. And then we're gonna get out of here, and we're gonna uh, we're gonna harvest this hemp like nobody's ever harvested hemp before. Just uh, bring your game and stay on track. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. We need the trailer too. We can't forget the trailer, guys. Get that trailer. Haven't even seen any fire yet. The fire's in the distance. <laughs> You're right. This is kind of like SnowRunner where there is actually no fire in it. But the fire is looming. You guys can see the smoke in the distance. Look at that smoke in the background up on the sky there. You see the smoke in the sky, chat? That, there is actually smoke. Where there's smoke, there is fire, chat. Yes, there is. Guys, tap those likes. We are almost at 400 today. We are 42 likes away, chat. 40 two likes away from the massive 400 can we do it chat can we do it go 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 don't stop all right we're gonna go okay let's turn on the harvester we're going to set it into work mode and we're gonna drop that device down there we go all right we're good speed running all right let's do it so we're gonna get as much hemp as we can remember we don't have to get all of it chat we just have to get as much as they need and then we got to work on those coffee beans, too. Where there's smoke, there's weed, but <laughs> Exactly. So let's get as much of this weed as we can. Uh, oh, man, that looks so good, doesn't it, chat? Oh, look at these fields. There are little buds. I see buds at the top. Is that normal for hemp? You see the little buds at the top of the plant there? There are little buds, chat. I see them, guys. Uh, you missed the very first one. Oh, I did? Dang it. <laughs> Dang it, darn it, son of a stink. Uh, just burn those, just burn that weed. Yeah. Denver says, uh, yay for weed. <laughs> exactly, Denver. Denver gets it. Let's get through here, chat. 
Uh, holler at your boy, right? Oh, thank you, Night Commander. I'm hollering at you there, sir. Yes, I am. Uh, I'm trying to go in a giant circle. You guys get all dibs. Chat, who would dive into this trailer head first and just grab as much as they could? Who would dive head first into this trailer and just grab as much as they could, fill their pockets, and run away? <laughs> uh, the buds sell for more. They do, yeah. They do sell for more. You're right. Uh, let's go this way, chat. Here we go. Ah, uh, me, 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 me. <laughs> me. Oh, wow. A lot of you guys would. Ledgewood, uh, Andrew Wood. Uh, is that weed? Yeah, well, it's hemp. It's, it's, I don't think it's technically, like, the, the, the get high weed. Uh, I think hemp has, like, way less, like, THC in it. But it is the male counterpart of weed. Um, I would say, Timothy, <laughs> it's farming hemp. Uh, that's not worth it. That's true. It's just farming hemp. You're right. Yeah, it's really not worth it. But we can pretend, chat. We can pretend, guys. Um, Kyle says, I, was ra ra bleh, I would rather rob your basement and mom's out. That would be smart. Yes. <laughs> that would definitely be smart. Uh, DEA has entered the chat. Uh oh. Uh oh. So the DEA, we're just uh, Ry says butts. I did. Yeah, I don't have an excuse. <laughs> I don't have an excuse. Uh, smells the same. It does. It smells the same. Uh, it's pretty much. Reggie. Reggie? Uh, making soap. Yeah, we're making soap. I wish I had some reggae music to play right now. Uh, storage is full. All right, let's go over there and get it, chat. Uh, we're just legitimate farmers in Columbia. Yeah, legitimate Colombian farmers, guys. Nothing to see here. <laughs> All right, there we go. Get this thing over here, chat. I wonder if you go faster in this thing if you turn off work mode. Let's try that. Uh, not really. You kind of go the same speed, I think. Yeah, it's like the same speed, chat. I don't know why. Uh, play Coconut Man. I can't, Jesse. Believe it or not, Coconut Man is copyright on YouTube. It was not copyright on Facebook, but it is copyright on YouTube, buddy. I cannot play the Coconut Man song. And I'm very, very sad about it. At least it's not cocaine. That's true, yeah. Oh, chat. You know what I was watching the other day? Um, there's a channel on YouTube called Live Police Chases. And let me just tell you, if you're not subscribed to Live Police Chases, you need to subscribe to Live Police Chases. Because <laughs> anytime there's a police chase in LA, uh, it pops up as a live. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. All right, now let's drop this off here. There we go. Let's see if that actually fills up. Well, anyways, I was I was watching that. I watched them. Yeah. Oh, they're hilarious. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's like a chase like almost every night too. Like they like every night at like 11 p.m. I get like a notification. <laughs> there's like a police chase in L.A. So yeah, serious. Yeah, it's called Live Police Chases. Um, so basically on that channel, I was watching a police chase the other day, and the guy was running from the cops, and uh, all you see is the window open, and the guy chucks something out the window, and it's just this big plume of white powder. <laughs> And everyone in the chat get, went nuts. I watch police chases on YouTube all the time. I love the ones from the cops dash game. Yo, those are good too there, Lindsay. You're absolutely right. These ones are usually from a, a helicopter, like a news helicopter. So that's the view you get. <laughs> he chucks something out the window. He chucks something out the window. And it's just like this blue, big plume of white powder. <laughs> and they kept like replaying it over and over again. That's a requirement to live in LA. Like it was so obvious. It was so obvious. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gotta do? What you gotta do? And you know what's great about it too is like half the chases, like the people get away. Like LAPD and like uh uh, what what is the California Highway Patrol called? The California Highway Patrol. The Cal the 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 Cal Highway Border Patrol. What am I saying? <laughs> um, the Cal Highway Patrol. They give up on a lot of these chases. So like. A lot of these cars are like they're they'll like steal like a chat. What's that Chevy car um, that like is really fast? The Chevy fast car. They'll like steal the Chevy fast car, and they'll like go like 170 out the highway, and the CHP cannot keep up with them, so they just let them go. So like every once in a while, you'll just see like a car just like get away. <laughs> the cops just give up. Camaro, yeah, yeah, Camaro, yeah, Corvette, Corvette. That's the word I was looking for. Yeah, they'll steal like a Corvette. And they'll run for the cops and they'll get away. It's crazy. Um, yeah. Uh, we'll see you there, Mr. Super Jesse. Have a good one there, buddy. Um, Raya, long time no see. What's up, Ian? Dude, Ian, how you doing there, buddy? Thank you for joining us today. Uh, Corvette easy. Yeah, Corvette easy. Yeah, they can get away. So, like, they'll steal, like, a, a super, 
uh, charged vehicle. But then, like, a lot of the times, most of them, like, crash. Like, somebody was trying to get away in a Kia Soul the other day. <laughs> the Kia Soul chase was amazing. That was amazing. Denver agreed. Yeah, I agree, Denver. Yeah, Chevy and Fast don't go hand in hand. I agree. Oh, we're going to tick off all the Chevy fans, guys. We're going to tick off those Chevy fans, guys. Look at me. I'm giving you all kind of things to watch now. I'm giving you Netflix shows, movies, uh, YouTube channels, Chevy Spark. <laughs> this is Wayne. Yeah. Yeah, I love watching uh, the live police chases. Those are always great. Uh, they're not always great. You never know what you're going to get. You never know what you're going to get, chat. You might get some wacky chase. You might get some cut and dry. Uh, Corvette smokes a... Uh, Hellcat any day. Oh, we ticked off Brandon. I'm sorry, Brandon. Brandon does like, I'm going to say something about that. <laughs> Chevy Spark. What is a Chevy Spark, Wayne? What is that? I saw a guy run a V6 Charger, uh, and he made it 300 yards. I know, exactly, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go deliver this. We have 55.6% already. Uh, I like to watch the show Cops and Live PD. Oh yeah, those are yeah, those were those were like the OGs there, uh, Lindsay. That's like some old school. Uh, those are the old school shows. That those are like the gateway shows into live police chase YouTube channels. Um, built for tough. Yes. Uh, Ryan, do you watch Smoking Gun World's Dumbest? No, I've never seen that, buddy. I don't know what that is. I do. I do see a lot of like uh, World's Dumbest videos pop up on my newsfeed, but I never really watch them. I don't know why, but uh, yeah, I probably should get into that. Uh, it's called On Patrol now. Oh, it's called On Patrol. So the so Cops is now called On Patrol. That's interesting. wonder why they changed the name of it. All right, let's dump this chat. We got to dump this. Old school. I still watch them. Oh, I'm sorry, Lindsay. <laughs> Those were like the OG shows what I meant. I didn't mean they were all old. I just meant like they were like the OG shows. Those were like the original shows. The chat. All right. We met the choir. Chat, why am I getting all excited and I can't talk? I met the requirements for the hemp. Okay, now, oh wait. Oh wait, should we do, co it said we met the minimum requirements. But it's not switching over to coffee though. What the heck? That's why my meter was so screwed up before, I see. Uh, it's all the hemp and why is you having trouble? It's all the hemp is why you're having trouble taking. Taking what? <laughs> Thinking what? Oh, whoops. Crap. Uh, all right, let me get that down, chat. Got to go back into work mode. Wait, what's happening? I'm oh, going to work mode. Ah, crap. What'd I do? Oh, talking. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, we're good now. Ah, uh, switch machines. Yeah, maybe we can switch machines. But, like, why wouldn't it just pop up to coffee? Let's do the coffee. Let's let's try to do the coffee. We'll switch to coffee. Now, I don't really know where the coffee is. So, let me let me just see here. Uh, what is that? That is... Number three. That looks like hemp. Okay, coffee is the, is the like, white little balls or whatever. Uh... Yeah, those like white balls or whatever. I don't know what those are. What does that look like? Let me see. Yeah, oh, coffee beans. They're not balls, they're coffee beans. Yeah. All right, let's go over here to our farm and let's go pick up our other piece of equipment. Yeah, we'll go over there and pick up our other piece of equipment, chat. Let's do that, guys. Uh, what did Orlando say, chat? What did Orlando say? Uh, Andrew is dropping the salmon arms. Thank you for the salmon arms there, buddy. Let's hurry up. Let's see if we can get this done. We got to get this done, chat. Now, I don't know where the coffee goes. Like, does the coffee go to the same warehouse? Does it all go to the same warehouse? I have no idea. Does anybody know? Uh, I believe. Thank you, Tyler. Thank you, buddy. Let me see here. Uh, let's just go this way. We'll go this way. Uh, we're going to go through the favelas here, chat. Whoa, whoa, what is this? We can't get through there. Wait, how do I get to my farm? Oh, dang it. Oh, we gotta go this way. Son of a steak. Yeah. Right stream, you're not doing the Facebook streams anymore. Oh my god, Ian. <laughs> Ian. Ian, I've been on YouTube for almost two years, buddy. <laughs> Where have you been? <laughs> it's been I've almost been on YouTube for longer than I was on Facebook. <laughs> Poor Ian. Oh man, you really haven't watched in a while. 
Oh dear. I've been in a uh, hospital. I, 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 I know. I'm just messing with you, buddy. Uh, I know. I know. There's a lot of people that have no idea. It's okay, buddy. <laughs> yeah, we've been here. We've been here for what? How many months have we been here? I, I started here in July of 2022, I think. July of 2022. Ian woke up and said, "Where am I?" Yeah, I, I think he's been in. Yeah, he's been. Uh, he's been busy, Chad. So I, I started here in July of 2022. It is. It has been a long time, but I'm glad you found it, man. That is pretty awesome. Glad you found it. Oh, follow the van channel, guys. Um, Dan Danison, can you drop another pin there, buddy? Or 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 Denver or somebody, a uh, moderator who could drop a link. I know only moderators can drop links, guys. Um, yeah, if you guys want to drop that link, uh, welcome back, Ian. Yeah, welcome back there, buddy. Thank you for uh for tuning in, my friend. But yeah, it's been a long time since I've been on Facebook, man. Facebook treated me like a pile of crap, so I was out of there. Um, yep, July 2022. Yeah, it was around that time when we started. Okay, so let me try to find these coffee, this coffee situation here. Let me go to the coffee fields. Yeah, okay, coffee fields are to the left. Let's go over the coffee fields. Oh, thank you, Dan. I appreciate that, buddy. So if you guys want to, that's where pretty much I'm moving to is the van channel. So I'm gonna pin that and click that link and uh, make sure you subscribe to the van channel guys if you wanna see all the van content. Cause I'm not gonna post any more van content on the gaming channel. Uh, I'm gonna keep the gaming channel and my coffee channel uh, separate guys. Or not coffee channel, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> uh, my van channel, I'm gonna keep them separate. Um, so you guys will be able to watch what you wanna watch when you wanna watch it. All right, done. Thank you, Lindsay, I appreciate that. Facebook sucks, it is really bad, yeah. Yeah, Oh. Dude, is this what coffee, like, plants look like? What is this? Work mode. Okay, let's get into work mode here. All right, let's see what this does. Whoa! Why are the beans red? Guys, tap that like as well. We're at 374 likes on the stream today. Will we get our goal of 400 likes today, chat? Will we do it? Time will tell. Now we have twice the riot. Well, no, it's no, it's gonna be a lot less riot actually. <laughs> uh, I'm probably only gonna post van videos maybe like once a week, I think probably, or maybe maybe I'll do. It just depends on like what I'm doing at the time. So if I'm like if I'm like on a big road trip, I'll probably do like a van video like every couple days. So like I'll have a day to film it, and then I'll have a day to edit it, and then I'll post it. So it'll be like that. Uh, coffee grows on trees, and then I'll probably do you know maybe like one or two live streams a week, just depending on how many new games are out. Um, that's probably gonna be what it's gonna be. Uh, because they have a red shell. Oh, so the coffee beans have a red shell. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, van video this weekend. I didn't go anywhere in the van this weekend. It has been freezing cold, but you know what I do want to do, Tyler? And let me know if you guys want to do this. I don't think this is gonna work, but I'm gonna try to do this. I'm gonna drive to the eclipse. So there's only a section of the country that is getting the full eclipse on, uh, I think it's April 8th, I wanna say. So I wanna stream the eclipse. So what I'll do is I will I will stream myself looking at the sun and then I will stream the sun when the eclipse comes, chat. Uh, we will have held the like streaks since October 2023. That is amazing, chat. You guys are doing awesome on those likes, chat. Has anyone tried the animal butt coffee? I've never even heard of that, Tobias. <laughs> is that a real thing? Tobias! That doesn't sound real. Give me animal, animal, animal butt coffee. What are you talking about? Let me Google this. Animal butt coffee. That doesn't even exist. <laughs> Tobias made it up. He made it up, chat. Why would you make that up? Shout out to Denver. Shout out to Gen uh, Denver there, F Jig. <laughs> Dude, look at them beans. Look at them coffee beans. They're massive. Dude, Colombian coffee beans are amazing. Show the results. The results are premium Kaya Kopi coffee, which has nothing to do with animals. Uh, then there's also the Kopi Luwak, also known as civet coffee, a coffee that consists of partial digestive coffee cherries. Oh, wait a second. Ew. Ooh, it does exist. Kopi Luwak, known as, oh my God, it does exist. What is this? It's coffee that's been, that's been shat out. 
Oh, 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 you can eat this? Oh, why is that a thing? Tobias was right. There's coffee that animals have digested. Why is the, why does that exist? Oh my God, that is so disgusting. <laughs> that is so disgusting. Why does that exist? Timer, oh yeah, the timer, oh my God. That, that, Tobias, you're screwing me all up. Um, time to brew some poo, yeah. Poo brew, they should just call it poo brew. That would be a marketable name. <laughs> poo brew chat, I agree with Tyler. I agree with Tyler, what did Tyler say? Uh, it says, order some Luat coffee, drink it on stream. <laughs> should, I? should I? All right. All right. Should I order some uh, Kopi Luak coffee, guys, and try it live on stream? That would be a terrible idea. Oh, my God. That would be so terrible. Ew. Oh, but anyways, let me go back to my, my comment that I was talking about earlier. Um, do you guys want me to try to stream the Eclipse? Now, here's the thing. Is everybody's going to rush to the Eclipse cities? Yes, do it. Okay. Well, I don't know what you're telling me to do. Now, you're telling me to... We were talking about two different things here. Um, I agree with Wayne. Oh, wow. I left the hat way too high up on my head there. <laughs> that was a five head indeed. Sorry about the five head. Sorry. Uh, yes, stream it. Okay. So first, let's talk about the eclipse. Should I stream the eclipse? Now, I'm going to have to pick a strategic place to go because I don't want to go to a city that like is in the eclipse because everybody's gonna be in that city and I probably won't have service to stream the eclipse because I'm, I'm gonna have to stream it from T-Mobile my, my home internet for the van uh, yes please so I'm gonna have to try to find like a small town maybe that has good internet but not a lot of people uh, yes while sipping poop coffee <laughs> yeah. so we can sip poop, uh, poop coffee and stream the eclipse uh, no to coffee. Yeah, I don't know if I want to... I'm not going to do that. I, I'm not drinking that coffee. That is absolutely not going to happen. So are you still with Lauren or what? I am still with Lauren. <laughs> still with Lauren, yes. Yes, Lauren is still... Lauren still dwells in my dwelling chat. Now, let me see. Where, where the heck is it? Okay, where do we have to drop this off, though? Do we have to drop that off the same warehouse? I think we do. Yeah, we do. So I'm going to stink. All right, we got to go all the way over there. All right, let's go over there, chat. Over there. So we got to go right, then straight... And then left at the T. Okay, right, then straight, then left at the T. So right here, then straight, then left at the T. Uh, top left says deliver to warehouse. All right, we're going to deliver to warehouse. Yeah, let's go deliver this hemp or er, coffee to the warehouse. Hopefully it lets us. Uh, isn't that poop coffee like $100 for a few servings? Yeah, yeah and I'm not, I'm not getting into that, buddy. That's not going to happen. <laughs> I'm going to need you to stream the eclipse. I probably won't be able to make it to see it. So you're going to have to pick up the slack. Uh, there is a crap load of small towns in Texas. I'm not going to Texas, Denver. No, it's got to be either Ohio or Pennsylvania. Um, those, are the those are the closest to me. I'm not going all the way out. Because, <laughs> like, it's either Ohio. I think Ohio's getting it. Northern Pennsylvania's getting it. Uh, like, northwestern Pennsylvania. Um, Ohio's getting it, like, right up the middle. And then I think uh, a little bit of Indiana is getting it. Uh, and then what's below Ohio chat? Uh, New, yeah, New York's getting it. Northern New York is getting it too. It's like, uh, above the Finger Lakes basically is where New York's getting it. Uh, Maine, Florida. Florida's not getting it. No, Florida's not getting it, Kyle. Florida won't be getting the eclipse there, buddy. Uh, there is a, there is some type of coffee that's worth $500 for eight, eight ounces of ground coffee. Really? That, that, I mean, honestly though, that's not surprising. It all, it's all due to like rarity and what people are willing to pay for it, you know? Uh, okay, so let's deliver this. Deliver hemp to the warehouse. Unload point. Maybe it's over here? Storage is full. What do you mean the storage is full? Uh-oh. You should come to Spiceland, Indiana. It's small. All right, I'll go to Spiceland, Kayla. That's a good idea. Spiceland. All right, I'll keep that in mind. Wrong warehouse. Yeah. Well, it's showing. Is there another warehouse? Where's the other warehouse? Uh. What is that? Hemp seeds. Where do I go? Um, I posted the path of the eclipse in Discord for everyone. Oh, yeah, yeah. So here's the path of the eclipse. It's a very small picture. 
but you can kind of get an idea of where it's going to go. It's going to go like Texas, uh, Missouri, uh, Ohio, Indiana, New York, Maine a little bit, it looks like. So, yeah, it's going to go like all the way up through there. So, I'm going to have to like stay like, you know, what, what is it? Chat, that's not the eclipse. This isn't the eclipse. <laughs> Bottom left building, maybe. Okay. Oh, no, that's a, that, oh, yeah, that is the coffee warehouse. That is the, oh, man, we got to go all the way down there. Are you serious? Okay, let's go down there. We got to hurry up. Timer's ticking. That's not the eclipse, chat. All right. <laughs> Don't laugh at him. Don't encourage him. Okay. Let's go down this way, chat. All right, now I know where we're going. Ah, uh, see the coffee field. No, it's actually down south. So we got to take the coffee to the coffee warehouse, guys. It's way down here. Son of a stink. Oh, wait. It's down this way. Son of a stink. Um, Chrome Clips. Yeah. And we're never going to make it, Chad. Are we, we're never going to make it. Uh, promote him. <laughs> promote him. Who even made that? Uh, Logan. Of course it was Logan, Chad. Logan made that, guys. Logan. Uh, we're not going to promote him, Mike Stockolosa. <laughs> uh, Lindsay's laughing for some reason. Um, we got, oh my god, I missed, the I missed two super chats here. We got Mr. Nick the Bar. Let's get some Nicks in the chat. Nick the Bar, thank you for the $20 super chat, buddy. He says, good afternoon, Ryan. I'm late. My twin brother was an accident today and had to check, make sure he's all good. Oh, I am so sorry to hear that. You have a twin brother there, Nick the Bar. Just when I thought there was already one awesome Nick the Bar, now there's two. Um, that is cool, buddy. Uh, thank you so much, man. Uh, not cool that your your brother was in an accident. I mean, cool that you have a twin brother. I didn't know that. But I'm sorry he was in an accident. Uh, hopefully he's all right. Is he all right? Have you? I guess you've talked to him, and I'm assuming he is. Hopefully he's fine. Thank you very much for uh, for letting us know that, buddy. Um, let's go around here, too. I uh, hope he's all right there, sir. Uh, hey, I just followed the two for your van. Thank you, Riley. I appreciate that. You're awesome. Thank you very, very much. I uh, appreciate you, Nick the Bar. And don't worry. You know, family always comes first, guys. You got to make sure... Everything's good in your little hood there, all right? So that is a good thing. Uh, thank you very much, Nick DeBar. You're awesome, sir. We also have um, Night Commander as well. Thank you for the generous five euro super chat as well. Appreciate that. Says, don't go to Ohio. They'll be getting up the pooper for a long time. Go blue. <laughs> chat, I, I want to... No, I didn't, FJ. I said it's awesome they added twin brother. I didn't know the added twin brother. I don't... Don't put words in my mouth, buddy. I definitely would never say that it's great that he was in an accident. It's horrible. But I hope he's all right. Hope he's all right. All right, drop zone. Drop zone. Let's drop this down, guys. Um, Vote for blue. <laughs> vote for blue. Thank you very, very much there, Night Commander. <laughs> You're making FJ mad, though, Night Commander. That's... I, oh, we did it! We did it, Green Dang. We only needed one load of coffee beans for that. Awesome, chat. Nice. Nice, chat. Nice. Uh, what did Denver say? Denver says nine more likes, chat. Nine more. Can we hold on to our 400 street, guys? All right. Sounds good, Ian. Hope you have a good day, buddy. Hope that everything's all right, my friend. Uh, hope you're getting good news as well there, buddy. Thank you very much for stopping in today. Night Commander, thank you very much there, buddy. So I'm thinking the only reason I would go to Ohio, though, is because the only real place in PA to go is Erie, and Erie's gonna be packed. Like, you, that's like the closest city to like, like a lot of population. So I feel like Erie's gonna be a terrible place to go for the eclipse, uh, just because of the sheer amount of people. You probably won't even get cell service. Uh, it's gonna be a disaster. So I'm thinking Ohio because nobody wants to go to Ohio, you know? Oh, uh, thank you, Ian. I'm glad, man. Hopefully, uh, hopefully I see you more, buddy. Read Denver's comment. Yeah, Denver's comment. Uh, let, let's actually look at the Eclipse map. I'm going to take a look at this chat real quick, so stick around. We'll take a look at the real map chat. All right, so here's the Eclipse map. Whoa, wait a second. Oh, it was, it was all skew. That was weird. Okay. So there's the Eclipse map chat. All right. Uh, just stream it off the TV. <laughs> I don't want to stream it off the TV. Um, <laughs> Tom Moser. Tom Moser just like streaming off the TV. I don't want to stream it off the TV, guys. All right. So there's the Eclipse map. Why can't I get that bigger? 
Chat, how do I make it bigger? Hold on. Let me, um... Oh, wait, can I just zoom in, maybe? Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. All right, there we go. All right, so that's the Eclipse map. Go visit Dan. Yeah, so it's going to go through, um, you know, Kerrville, Texas, a little bit of San Antonio, Dallas, Tyler. Then it's going to go through uh, whatever this state is. I think that's Missouri. Um, or wait, no, is that Missouri? What is that? No, that's not Missouri. Is that Missouri? What state is this, Chad? I can't remember. <laughs> Um, oh, this is Arkansas. Yeah, 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 Arkansas. That's right. That's not Missouri. Missouri's over here somewhere. Um, that's Arkansas. And then it's going to go through Missouri. So Arkansas and then Missouri, uh, a little bit of eastern Missouri, then a little bit of southern Illinois, okay, then Indianapolis, Indiana area, southern Indiana, then western Ohio and northern Ohio here through Cleveland, then Erie, PA, and then Buffalo, New York, Rochester, uh, and then Messina, Burlington, and um, a lot of northern Maine here as well. Uh, you wrecked in all those states. I did, yeah. So so what I, my options here are basically like Erie or anywhere in Ohio, basically, is, is going to be the easiest for me to get in, like this stretch right here. Uh, so, you, so You mean Arkansas. Yeah, or Kansas. <laughs> or Kansas. So I don't really know where to go. I'm thinking like one of these little, you know, you know, like weird little towns like you know, like Wooster. I've been to Wooster. I've been to all these towns. I used to deliver to all these Walmarts. So I'm very familiar with all these. I kind of want to stay away from the coast because I feel like a lot of people are going to be up on the coast. Um, so I'm thinking like maybe one of these little towns over here like that nobody would go to. Like Marion or Mansfield or Finley, Tifton, Wooster, uh, Bellefontaine. A lot of like no population out here in the middle of Ohio, guys. So, you know, and I'm very familiar with all those towns. I, I delivered to every single Walmart in Ohio. Uh, or Conneaut. Yeah, Conneaut would be good too. But I feel like, e dude, like everyone in PA is going to be rushing to this to this area. Like PA, this is going to be a, a jam-packed up-the-butt area, chat. It is going to be packed. Conneaut, Lake, Erie, um, all these areas. We got a sliver of PA that's getting the, uh, the eclipse. I'm thinking Ohio, chat. I'm thinking Ohio. I'll just stream from a cornfield, guys. So that might be the best place to go. Uh, and keep in mind, I'll be in the van. You know what I'm saying? I'll be in the van, guys. So it's not like uh, James Hall. No, what, what did James say? Danny going to Maine. I don't think Dan's going to Maine. Dan's down south. Why would he go to Maine when he lives in one of the states that it's coming to? <laughs> Why would Dan go to Maine? Why would Dan go to Maine? Dan, Dan, don't you live in one of the states? Kansas. Missouri. Yeah, Missouri. <laughs> yeah, it's going through Missouri. Southeastern part of Missouri, where nobody is. <laughs> yeah, so Dan could just go here. Or here. Wherever. I don't know where he's from in Missouri. <laughs> to, get away from, to get away from you. <laughs> Mike Stuckles, I'm not even in Missouri. But it wouldn't make any sense. He would be going closer to me by going to Maine. <laughs> Uh, I'll go to Maine since Deborah. Yeah, Maine might be cool, though. Like, northern Maine, there ain't dog diddly squat up here in northern Maine except lakes. Dude, Maine might be... Should I go to Maine? Should I go to Maine, chat? Oh, that would be kind of cool. Uh, look at the nothingness in Maine here. There is nothingness up here, chat. Like, absolute nothingness. Alaska would be cool, too. Yeah, Alaska would be cool. Or northern New York. But, like, northern New York, I, I don't know. That might be pretty packed because all the people from, like, you know, New York and the East Coast and stuff... Uh, go to Maine. Yeah, I kind of want to go to Ohio. Nobody, I feel like nobody's going to go to Ohio. I feel like right here, like right smack in the middle, like Kenton, Ohio. Nobody's even heard of Kenton, Ohio before. Let's go to Kenton, chat. <laughs> uh, I'm in Illinois. Bring lots of money and tax money. So here's what's going to happen, chat. So what's going to happen is um, it's going to be going through here like this, like this big blob. So we're going to be able to see it uh, probably April 8th around... 3.12 p.m. is when it's going to be, like, in Ohio. There's the blob of the uh, solar eclipse. So it's going to be passing through Ohio at 3.12 p.m., chat. So that's when I'll go live. I'll probably go live, like, a little bit before it um, on Eclipse Day. 8,000 people uh, live in Kenton, Ohio. Yeah, so I'll be hanging out with those 8,000 people in Kenton, Ohio, chat. Right, come to see me in Ontario. Ontario would be cool, too, there, David Lalonde. I wish I could, buddy. Check hotels to see if it's going to be packed. Well, I'll be in the van, Robert. That's the thing. The only thing I'm worried about, Robert, is A, the locations of parking, and B, the cell signal. That's what I'm talking about. You, If you get a bunch of people in an area, 
the cell signal starts to degrade. So it's going to be very, very difficult for me to stream with no T-Mobile signal. So that's why I'm kind of trying to stay out in the cut, but yet still somewhere in civilization is cell signal. Uh, I'm not worried about hotels because I won't be staying in a hotel. I could stay in the van anywhere I want. Uh, Chet's going to Kenton now. In the, <laughs> the whole chat's going to go to Kenton now. Uh, I think Walmart lots will be empty. Yeah, Walmart lots would be good. Any, any open area would be great. Um, and Ohio's got a lot of open flat land, chat, for good cell service. So that might be might be the place to go. Somewhere in the middle of Ohio, I'm thinking. Um, now I might also stay near a near like a a highway too, just because highways usually have better cell signal also, and uh, that might be a good place to do it as well. Uh, literally, yeah. So that's gonna do it for today's stream chat. But thank you guys for watching today. You guys had fun. Make sure you type hashtag fun. 411 likes on the stream today. Oh my god. Seven new members, which, you know, is, is not our best, but we did pretty good today, chat. Thank you so much for those uh, gifteds earlier and those of you that became members today. I appreciate it, guys. Uh, later on, we'll see you there, Ringo. Thank you very much. Thank you for the hashtag funds, guys. I appreciate it. Bon, yeah. Uh, I will sell my shirt in Kenton on the 8th. <laughs> so my t-shirt. Sounds good there. <laughs> oh, my God, Danny Smith. I'm going to wear Danny Smith's t-shirt. Look how fast it goes through, too. This is wild. Look how fast it'll go through. So it'll start the eclipse at about 310-ish, 311-ish, and then it'll end by like 315. That is crazy. So that's how fast the eclipse is going to go through there. Uh, Moon Shadow looks like a potato. It does. It does look like a potato. Can you believe it? <laughs> uh, thank you very much there, Night Commander. And thank you very much there, Mr. Jason Sch uh, Sch Schistler as well. For the 14 months, as Ryan, I live in Finley. You live in Finley? No way. You're going to be right, dude. That might be a good city to go to, Jason. Because look at this. A, it's right off a highway. What highway is that, Jason? And B, uh, that looks like maybe... What is that? Gonna, what is that, 77 there? No, that wouldn't be 77. Be, I don't know what highway this is. What highway is that? What highway is that? Uh, don't DOT heaven in Ohio. Yeah, I know. But I'm in a van now. I'm in a personal van. DOT can't mess with me, chat. All right, that's I-75. Okay, that's I-75. All right. Finley, Ohio is like right smack dab in the middle of it. That looks like a great place to go. Right off of 75 and also in the middle of the zone here, chat. Um, 311, yeah. Thank you for the uh, for the support there, Mr. Harry V and Jason Sisler. Appreciate it, guys. Um, yeah, so that's going to do it, chat. So I'll try to stream. Go to someone's house, use their Wi-Fi. <laughs> Dan, Dan, I don't need to, buddy. I got, I got Starlink, which is not good for streaming. I still haven't tried it in an open field yet, so or an open parking lot yet, so I can't write off Starlink yet, but I feel like T-Mobile will be way better for streaming, guys. Um, see you, Doug Meyer. Have a great one there, buddy. Bye, Ryan, chat. Remember, chat, probably no stream tomorrow. I apologize in advance, but uh, tomorrow I do have a wedding to go to, so I do not want to cross those streams or be late for the wedding and have to rush to get ready and all that fun stuff, so probably no stream tomorrow. We'll probably be back on Monday, guys, all right? And next week, we got two new games, too. Two new games, chat! Hey, oh, no, I'm sorry. Three new things next week. I'm getting my new wheel Monday. Is it your wedding? No. Monday, I get my new wheel. Tuesday, Prison Architect 2 comes out. And I think Friday, Denizen comes out next week. So that'll be awesome, streaming the wedding. <laughs> I'm not streaming the wedding. Um, thank you very much, Harry Vanola. Uh, appreciate you. Monday Tow Truck Tip. Yeah. So I'll pre I'll be getting the new wheel on Monday. Uh, Denizen is next week, the 29th, whatever day that is. And Prison Architect 2 comes out next Tuesday as well, the 26th. So that'll be awesome, chat. I am looking forward to next week. Yeah, yeah, Deborah. Yeah, Deborah. Um, I'll be excited. Denizen. Yeah, Denizen's finally coming out, the 29th, guys. Yeah, that'll be awesome. That game is so cool. So, a lot of good stuff next week, chat. Make sure you tune in. Uh, I'm in Melb. Melb? You're in Melb, FJig? What is Melb? <laughs> Where's, where are you at, FJig? Where, where are you located there, buddy? Um, that demo was awesome. It was, yeah. The demo was like a whole game. We got like a three-hour stream out of, the, out of the demo, chat. That was pretty good. Uh, but yeah, that's going to do it for me. I see the sun out today. I might go out in the sun today, chat. 420 likes on the stream today. <laughs> nice, chat. Nice. Uh, Sydney, Australia. Oh, you're from Australia, FJ. I see, buddy. Oh, cool, man. That's awesome there, buddy. Well, hello from Down Under. Or no, you're Down Under. 
Hello from up and over. <laughs> uh, I looked at the map of Australia once, up chick. Yeah, F let's see if uh, Australia's in the path. Is Australia in the path? No. Where is Australia? I don't even know where it is. Oh, it's this way. Or wait, no. It's Australia. Oh, there it is. Oh, it doesn't show. It doesn't show. This this is only American path. Dang it. <laughs> uh, later on, chat. We'll see you there, uh, Nathan. I'm in Germany. Oh, you're in Germany? Oh, yeah. Night Commander's in Germany. Um, have a good weekend. Thank you, Tracy. You have a great weekend, too, buddy. Hope you have a wonderful one. Buy shirts is here. Yeah, I'm going to go get a shirt. I got to get a shirt. We don't really exist. <laughs> I know you don't. Yeah, you're, you're not really there. You're just a figment of my imagination. Um, who hits that like button? <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Uh, dark side of the mood. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's because it's the dark side. You're right. They won't see it because it'll be like nighttime when the eclipse hits. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. They won't be able to see it. So it's only in America we can see the eclipse chat. Uh, Deutschland. Deutschland. Thank you very much there, Mr. Harry B. Have a great one, sir. Um, Robert Z as well. It'll be nighttime. Yeah, it'll be nighttime in Australia. That makes sense. Yeah. So they wouldn't see the eclipse anyway. Um, thank you very much there, Mr. Harry. I will see you guys on what day, chat? What day will I see you? Uh, probably Monday. Most likely Monday. Maybe stream tomorrow. But if we do, it'll be a shorty chat. Very short one, guys. I'm going to get there F1 in a year or two. Oh, oh cool, buddy. That's cool. You're going to be an, you're gonna be watching an F1 event? Is that it? Or are you going to be like driving an F1 event? <laughs> the eclipse is fake. It might be fake, Oliver. That's why I'm going to report. We're going to see if the eclipse is really real. That's why I want to report. I don't want to know if it's really real or if it's fake, chat. I'll give you the true news about the eclipse, all right? Oh, you'll be watching it. That's cool there, FJ. <laughs> Uh, nice legs. Oh, don't look at my legs, chat. Am I showing my legs on stream? Ew. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, chat. <laughs> don't look at my Don't look at my knees. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to show my knees. Ew, that's so gross. <laughs> Nothing's worse than a streamer's knee. Uh, Germany is awesome. Been there twice. Yeah, Germany is cool. Um, see ya. All right, we'll see you there, Tobias. Have a good one, buddy. All right, I'm out, chat. Have a great afternoon. I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace out, everybody. Well, yeah. My knees aren't bruised, Ryan. How would knees even get bruised, buddy? <laughs> Dan, Dan, I believe it. I absolutely believe it. Oh, Harry. Look at Harry getting the vlog in at the very last second. Thank you for the vlog sticker there, buddy. Appreciate you, Mr. Harry V. I feel like he's like 30 seconds behind. He doesn't know we ended the stream already. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Now I got to do another boing. It ain't over till the fat streamer boings. <laughs>